Hey guys, hello and what's up and welcome to another episode of The Fallen Fett Chronicles. I am your host Ernie, the one and only Fallen Fett. Thank you very much for being here. You can be so many different places on a Wednesday night, but you chose to be here. We love that. We greatly appreciate it. We have a great show for you tonight. Of course, we're going to get into all the the regular hijinks. How was our week? Uh, what's going on? Uh, we got to talk to the co-hosts. We got to talk to the Federation, to the chat, to the Yokuza, to the Darioites. Is that what I call them? I don't even remember. Uh, we're going to get into some trailer stuff, some conspiracy stuff. And there was Star Wars talk. So we're going to get, you know, just right into it. Making her way back. Still not 100%, but thank you so much for being here. All the way from her world tour to Tokyo, Japan. Japan, Japan. The real Japan. The one and only Yoko McCann. And I know that to be true now. Like, it's McCann. McCann, McCann. McCann, McCann. <laughs> Yeah, like you know, you're <laughs> Irish, so yeah. Yes, I am. McCann, McCann. Yeah. Who Hi. knew? Who I did it? Who everybody knew. I don't know. I everybody so. knew. Everybody knew. Now it's time to blow up. Look, everybody's mes messaging everybody. Oh my God, Yoko's on. Yoko's on. Hurry. Exclusively on the Fallen yes. Back Chronicles. Oh, I know. I love that. Exclusively. Speaking <laughs> of exclusive, Yoko went all the way to Tokyo, and all I got was this shirt that she sent and that was it it was weird though she what? told me i had to go to ross to pick it up like if she <laughs> sent it there i don't, I don't know why but it says just, tokyo just, on it when he gets his mail at ross <laughs> yeah <laughs> she's like i'll send it there i know he'll get it yeah. so that's fine what's up I, yoko i, I know unfortunately have, I, you're sick. i do have something for you though you do i should have planned ahead but um, yeah. Since I'm mailing you stuff anyway, well, next week you'll have it. Okay, that right. sounds good. That is awesome. I, I'm totally, totally already beside myself. So yeah. thanks for being here. I know you're sick. That sucks. I'm like ninety percent healthy. I think. You know. Okay, that's good. That's maybe. good. Maybe. Maybe. I mean, you were gone. Healthy. I was gone, and then you're mm -hmm. sick. Like that's the worst. To yeah, come to back come and back get sick. sick. Yeah, yeah, and my last, my like my last couple of days was kind of, you know, I when I when I started feeling it too. So I feel like yeah, I couldn't really like go out with a bang. <laughs> I was yeah. slowed down already. And it's yeah. it's funny because then too, like nobody believes you, right? It's like you just didn't want to come back. Yeah. Oh, you're jet lag, and it's like, dude, I'm sick. Like I'm you not know, doing anything. The key to defeating jet lag is to just be sick, and then you just sleep. <laughs> Yeah, and then you sleep the whole time on there. <laughs> yeah. What was your plane flight like? Twenty-seven hours or something? No, nope, it was not that bad. It was actually oh. closer to um, eight hours coming home, so it's really not that bad. You know, it was like it was like ten hours going there and like eight hours coming home. Oh wow! All right. Yeah, dude. So when we went to Florida, we got there mm -hmm. so fast and so early. Yeah, it was crazy. Almost like an hour ahead of time. And that threw off our all our plans. It oh, was, was a problem. Yeah, it was insane because like we were gonna wait for her sister to pick us up and mm -hmm. just be around um, Orlando mm -hmm. Airport. Like they have a yeah. Disney store there, the yeah. Universal store. Like we would have been covered, right? We yeah. showed up so freaking early. Everything was closed. Oh, everything was in the morning. Mm. Yes, yeah. yeah. And I'm thinking like. Isn't this like a major airport? Like, you know, when you see it, of course, I live my life through movies. Like, why is everything closed? I thought everything would be open. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Like that of such a major airport that I did. I, that's what I was thinking. Like, why is this? But yeah, it was it was for us. So I'm glad you got home quicker. Did something yeah. just fall? Yes. Oh, Larry, Larry knocked over oh. my cup noodles bag. He's trying to Dang get in it. my cup noodles bag. I walked in. And um, I'm not making this up. And I said out loud, I'm like, oh, it's going to be a great show tonight. The my um, which bucket is that? Who's the blue ones? The blue bucket was shaking by itself and my hats mm -hmm. fell that are on top of it. Oh, and I don't know why it was shaking and felt right. And that's why I was like, oh, it's going to be an interesting show tonight. All right, here we go. So, yeah, 
And we'll see. We'll see what happens. Yeah, but that was that was cat related. So all right. Yeah, it's not haunted. Unless Larry, Larry, just leave it alone. Oh my gosh. Larry. Um. Yeah. So how was the trip? Good and everything. I know everybody's waiting on your content, but yeah, yeah. Things- my content so- will start tomorrow, guys. Okay. Um, that's awesome. Um, and it'll last me a while. I tried to make a list of all the content I want to make, and it's it still got a little overwhelming. Um, Larry. No, it's so overwhelming. I have so much to show, and then like I really need to get it together because I have a different phone that I use to shoot with. What does he do? He's in a bag. What bag is that? He's, he's trying to get into the cup nude. He bag. is. Look at he's almost there. His butt is just sticking out. Charlie Brown, <laughs> Snoopy. What's in there? Nothing. I don't think anything's in there. Mm. Look at I do see a Captain Carson Tiva helmet in the background that was used for yep. today's shot. <laughs> yep. It Did sure you was. like my comeback video? It was. I mean, like you put me to shame. Let's be honest. <laughs> Um, we're gonna, have to, put, we're gonna have to put that side. We're gonna have to do a side by side there. We're gonna have there to. I, I'm I'm surprised okay. nobody in the chat yet has already done it. So Linger Luz must have been busy. Yeah. He, no. Oh my God! You got to see the one he did do. He did just one. now. With, I know he did. I, he was busy putting Paul's reaction to you. That's yes, so with Paul's. I, ju- reaction. I just shared it as you were going live. Yeah. That's the best. Yeah. Oh my God. Paul Probably me real. The, the real reaction shame I yeah believe he has a, i can't believe he has a camera on paul at all times that is that is so hilarious it was yeah. great i love it yeah i just shared it too but somebody will have to do our side by side comparison to who did it better <laughs> you did, and you we'll did it see. better i will concede no way yeah, yeah. now Shout we just need to... paul and kev to do it too though oh my god yeah. and, oh, i heard kevin in my head already you can shoot a video for your show but you can't send me a video <laughs> I was in work clothes, bro. No, I need to. Oh, you didn't do it last night? I'll do it right after this. No, I didn't do it Monday night. I ended up, Mm -hmm. um, uh, um, what did I end up with after? It just like turned too late. Because like on those shows, like I don't get to see Corinne Mm -hmm. or anything. And then yesterday Mm -hmm. was, I've been trying to clean this room so bad. Like I hate, where am I? Uh, Right here. I hate these blank spots because I've moved and readjusted stuff. I yeah. hate that I'm not done yet with it. I now have figures on the ceiling, which you can't see. Yeah. Um, that I need to finish. But I did clear out the Ross store. You cleared out the Ross, you cleared out Ross store. Period. I clear yeah. And the store <laughs> that I had going on in here. Mm. Um, it's now in the living room because I'm slowly opening everything, oh. getting the doubles opening. to the people that need it. Yeah. I don't have room. That's why I'm going on the ceiling. Can I show it a little bit? Let me see. Look at see. Oh wow! Yeah, I started going on the mm-hmm. ceiling. So <laughs> that'll yeah. be fun when it falls in the middle of a stream one day. Shh, shh, don't say that. No, I'm making sure that, that doesn't happen. Don't <laughs> jinx it. Because I swear to God, right now, if one falls, I'm gonna be so mad. Because yeah. I've done everything to make sure that it stays. So I hope it happens on stream. Oh God. <laughs> yeah, so I have everything set for that. I know mm-hmm. I'm getting out the people's stuff who I got stuff for, um, people who sent me. Like, I had such a good team out there finding everything. Like, you I know Karen was pissed. Team out there? I had the best team out there. Uh, mm-hmm. Santo, Mike, mm-hmm. um, uh, 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 Justin Ross. Wow, you um, can't even remember them. I can't because so I had it written down. There was like, there's seven people out there who are Ross hunting. <laughs> Literally. Yeah. But at the same time, I'm making sure that everybody's covered in who needed stuff. Yeah. You know, so that nobody had to pay the scalper prices and everything like that. So, yeah, because it's getting crazy with the Ross stuff. So that's what I've been doing. So I haven't had time, but I swear to God, Kevin, I will send you the <laughs> video. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And Yoko mm-hmm. has reminded me, mm-hmm. but it's just that whole time constraint. Speaking of time constraint, I'm not going to be on tomorrow. So I'm letting everybody know now. No. I'm going to go to the movies with some friends and the girls. What? Um, Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, it's diehard. I got invited by friends, and the mm -hmm. girls are gonna go, and Corinne and I. So, yeah, uh, I'm I'm not gonna be on tomorrow. Sorry, hmm. guys. It'll wow. be covered though. I promise it will be covered. Um, yeah. So you know, after vacation, last week's show. Did you even get a chance to catch it? Like where you're in and out of falling asleep. I was. I just. I just talked I to the chat. The I whole saw time. most of it. I was in the chat. Oh, okay. But I didn't know if like you were passed out. I might have yeah. been a little bit in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, you know, we'll we'll do that. Yeah. But that's good. I know you have your content yeah. coming. Um again, I yeah. know you're not hundred percent, so thank you for being here. If you have a coughing fit, just turn off your camera because I don't want oh, these guys to use it against you. <laughs> oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah. Um no, yeah, I, I w wish I would. I was like, should I make a, <laughs> should I make a show and tell like like presentation to talk about my trip? You know, like <laughs> my summer vacation, my spring break. Yes, PowerPoint. would be great. But, you're gonna um, have to because you're out there for a while, and that's some yeah. place that a lot of us don't get to visit. Like yeah. Corinne is saying, you know, yeah, Yoko, when we make the Tokyo Disneyland happen, you need to come with us. Yeah, yeah. you're going to need to be our guide for real. I would love, I know, I would, it was really fun. And, be you know, because I was doing a lot of it or some of it, maybe not as much of it as I want to do alone. Um, uh -huh. But like, ha like it was, it was really fun to be able to use my, you know, to use my Japanese and to navigate the trains and stuff like that. And like, I do want to tell people if you're planning a trip and you know, you don't speak Japanese, like as long as you do your research ahead of time, like the trains are pretty easy to follow if you know where you're going, you know, so you can like Google, you know, look it up ahead of time to figure out what, what trains you're taking to get places. And then if you, if you know what you're looking for, it's pretty easy to find because all the signs are in English too at the train stations. You, you know, I'm still lost though. I well, yeah, lost. I didn't mean you. I meant, mo I meant most, <laughs> I meant most people. <laughs> yeah. Other people. So that's cool. You got to catch up and use your Japanese. Did you have to yeah. use your Irish or no? You I, did not, I did not use right. my Irish at all um Except yeah yeah no that was good but um no, no but everybody's gonna everybody's gonna want to see those videos and everything yeah. to share they are yeah i've been trying to figure out like how to split it up into the little videos you know so i'm gonna do like minute long vlogs over a period of i don't know however many days it takes me to get through it um just uh -huh. kind of splitting it up it's like it's mostly chronological so far as far as i've gotten you know and then i'll probably do some extra content on youtube with like um, I filmed the whole Beauty and the Beast ride at Disneyland. So, you know, I'll do a whole, I'll do a video just for that. The whole Gundam thing will be a separate video on YouTube too, probably. And, you know, some of these things I'll just do like quick little shots on, um, in reels. Nice. But um, some of them will get fuller videos on I YouTube. I think that's super cool that you got to do the Gundam yeah. thing. Like I'm not yeah. a Gundam fan. Like I know of it. And yeah, of course the giant robots yeah. and everything. But yeah. when I've seen that, I was like, oh my God, that'd be amazing to see. And you're like, yeah, I'm going to go see that today. I was like, oh. Yeah, it's awesome. It's, I didn't know cool. it was yeah. in that close to you. Yeah, you know, and I mean, it really, it's not, it was on my way to my grandma's, you know, kind of uh -huh. like on the way, like, you know, so um, I was able to swing by to see it um, for that on that, you know, um, on my way to see family. So it worked out, you know, but um, yeah. maybe not something I would have necessarily gone out of my way to do as I am not a Gundam guy either. <laughs> but um, it was really cool to see, you know. Rensu says, can we hear your Irish, Yoko? You know that's a super chat, Rensu. Do you oh, remember yeah. what show is going on right now? You need to calm down with yourself asking for freebies. Jesus and Christ. I am Irish, but I am also fighting Irish. Don't forget. I can show fighting, you fighting Irish. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Well, that's cool. We all can't wait for that content. Um, I got to give it to all the creators. For everybody who does something, I have so many stupid videos to post, and I don't have the time. I try at night and then I see something is messed up and I don't like it myself. So then I lose it. I'm like, I'm yeah. out of it to post it. I'm out of it to everything. Right. Yeah. Um, like I have the food stuff that I need to put up for um, the food and wine that's going on right now in DCA um, Sunday. I can put that one out. That was really cool for the first time out of how many times. And now it's long rise of the resistance. We, we rode on Sunday. That was the first time I got to be in the cockpit, the oh, the very really? front of it. Yeah. 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 I, I never knew what that looked like. There's always so <laughs> many people. I'm always just by the door. Yeah. Um, and we were like, oh my God. So I filmed the whole thing. It was amazing. I, yeah. I fell in love with the ride all over again. So, mm -hmm. like you're saying, Beauty and the Beast, I want to put that up. Yeah. Um, 
I, I have um I have all the Avengers merch and merchandise that when I switched to the phones, I switched the wrong video. It was like my test video, and uh, I keep forgetting to put the correct video to YouTube. So yeah. I need to do that. But mm -hmm. yeah, I I give it to everybody who freaking shoots content and puts up videos because it's not so easy. It, it's not. It, it takes time. It takes a lot to it's, to it's get easy it out. To get discouraged too, right? Especially the it way, is. Like, with the algorithm and how everything is these days. Um, like I keep saying, like every time I post something, I lose followers. You know. <laughs> Yeah, but my, my account's been losing followers every day for five years. It's 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 easy to get discouraged, but you just you kind of like just have to not worry about that and be doing it because you want to yes. do it, right? Yeah. And so, yeah. um, and for your five friends who who are looking to see it, right? It's like that. That's yeah. who you need to. That's who you need to create your content for, and try not to. We're humans, so we we let those other things bother us too, but we have to try not to. Yeah, absolutely. And that's what happens with me. I, I hear something or I see something or the phone shut off by accident. So now it started all over and I'm like, yeah. what, yeah. you know, so yeah, I'll get there guys. So at the same time, that was an apology to the Federation for not having videos out. Like I promise I have videos, but it does take a lot. And yeah. I'm always so busy. Like, of course, like I, everybody is, but you know, like this, we were, you know, we ran in here and I'm like, Yoko, it's six. Oh my God, I'm, I'll be right there. Like, you know, it's, yeah. it comes so quick and yeah. I'm already trying to hurry and everything. So, yeah, but there's been a lot to talk about. So let's check in with the uh, Federation and see who's here real quick and say what's up. And then we'll, we'll jump into whatever everybody wants to talk about. Sounds good. Um, first up, big fan. Grumps is so happy that... <laughs> That she is back. <laughs> He's only here for the Yoko Chronicles. Mm -hmm. You know what? I got to talk to Chamba because I don't know this stuff. Like, he sends me everything, but that's right. You guys can't see my arrow. I always think you guys can see my arrow. Um, The Fallen Fat Chronicles up in the corner uh -huh. over there. Uh huh. We need to put one that says, like, Yoko Chronicles, Dario Chronicles. Oh, yeah. Like, I don't have that in here for you guys to switch when we do <laughs> oh, that type yeah. of thing, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Little things like that. You see what I'm saying? Like, I always yeah. forget. Um, we need to do an updated entry video now. Now that it's the three of us. Yeah. Guys, unfortunately, yes, Dario's unable to make it tonight. The man on the street is out there. I already saw him in the chat. Um, but, of course, Dario hops in when he can, and we greatly appreciate that. Can we send in the link? But, I guess he permanently has the links now. Yeah. He's, he's good to go now. We've cleared that up. He can <laughs> pop in anytime he wants. Yeah. Speaking yeah. of, I got to re-clean it up because Dario did some housekeeping in here and I got lost and scared. I, I didn't know what's going on. I need to do lost housekeeping myself. Yeah, there's <laughs> everything in here. And I was like, what happened? So, yeah, mm -hmm. we'll we'll get into all that. But, oh, I was saying we need a new, like, um, opener. A new yeah, video it'll with, be like, the three of us removing our helmets side by side. <laughs> I didn't get a helmet, remember? I'm still. Well, your it. hat is, your, is fine. Maybe okay. Dario will do something. Or we can just always just put Dario in the shower. That's right. Yes. Dario in the shower is the best. <laughs> That's the whole Ferris Bueller for me. <laughs> that that gets me every time. But yeah. So mm -hmm. yes, you were missed greatly. Mm -hmm. Grumps was making his run around everywhere. Um, so he prefers it, the Yoko Chronicles. What's up, Grumps? Yeah. Thanks for being here. Thanks he was on Chat Migos yesterday. Make sure and uh, go check out that replay. Mm -hmm. Uncanny Scalps, who's on Monday nights as well. Uh, he's out playing Lorcana right now. What's up? Mm -hmm. uh, Mark mm -hmm. Rose is here. Just here for Yoko. Okay. Hi, Mark Rose. Hi, Mark. Uh, yeah. Here too, Fallen Fat Chronicles. What's up, Jesser? Uh, welcome back from Japan. Have a great show, Ernie. Jesse has oh, a brand new you. show out there as well, too. I believe they're on Mondays as well, which makes it a hard scheduling because we have Boba Squadron on Mondays. Yeah. So now Mondays are turning into the new Wednesdays, basically. <laughs> it yeah. is. Winger Luz, always helping mm. out everywhere he can. Thank you so much, Winger Luz, for that. That was freaking hilarious. Oh, my God. I was laughing. I just saw Paul's. <laughs> so quick with it. I know. Yeah. That was great because his reaction is perfect. Like, I had to watch it twice. Mm -hmm. that, that's why I was late because I was laughing so hard. <laughs> I was. Toy Rensu, what's up? Tommy K. Mr. Oh, what did I call him? Tommy K. Trivia King. The trivia oh. king is in the house. Can't wait mm -hmm. for when Tommy comes back and we get hit with another one. 
Uh, speaking of the crew, Santo 1414, what's up? Thank you. Um, he hit me with a lot um, of everything, and I'm trying to find his. If we can't find anybody who has either you're not using or you have an extra of the X-Force Disney pack, the three pack with Cannonball, Domino. I can't remember who the one was. Santo needs that. So if you have an extra or you're not using it, hit me up. I'll let Santo know or hit Santo up. But hit me up and I'll let him know. Um, but I also have to go through storage and check my stuff. Either way, he will be covered. Um, so let's see. Toy Rensu. Yes. Not only the Federation, but the Yoko Yokoza. Yokoza. I had to say it out loud, like you said. Yeah. Sound things out. Yokoza is here. Um, let's see. Marcus Yi is here. Stormfired Blizzard. What's up? We are in talks right now. Greetings and salutations from Phoenix. You're in Phoenix today. You're That's in talks awesome. right now? We're in talks for uh, something special. Oh, I'll let yeah? you know a little behind the scenes action. What's going oh. on? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, let's see. Matt Logic is making a world tour as well. He's been up there with uh, Kevin and Paul, and he will be there for Kevin's toy show going on. Paul signing. Tommy will let you know all about it. Tommy's going to put it in the chat. Um, he has all the info that you're going to need to be a part of Kevin's show going mm -hmm. on in April. Right, Tommy? Thank you, Tommy. Yes. Uh, Tony Rensu, Sonic Rockman X, Yoko. You look, whoa. Can I say that? No. <laughs> yeah. That was Sonic Rock Man X just throwing it out there. Oh, where's my where's my? Oh, that was the thumbnail. Did you know that that came from a video? Because she's got competition out there, bro. I'm just letting you know. You might want to check uh my stories as well. Okay. But uh, I'll go for it. At Yoko. You look sexy in the thumbnail of the episode. <laughs> Wait till you see me next week, then. Uh, let's see. Marcus Yee, Matt, Doombot 9000. Yo, what up, Ernie? How's it going? Yoko's here, too, Doombot. No. Uh, oh, look at it right there. Saved himself. Happy Thursday, Ernie. Thanks. <laughs> Made sure to get that comment out, though, right? What's up, Mark? Zap's in the house. How's it going? Zap, did you finish Avatar? uh zap i've worked with him for a long time and all we do is uh tv talk and everything walking dead are you guys into the brand new uh rick and michonne one i gave it a chance i broke it down for zap why i do like it i didn't like it at first i used to do a show called podcasting dead with uh moocher and we did that for quite a while um i was thinking about these last episodes like I wonder if me and Mooch should do a uh, catch up like on the season or maybe just break down the season because I am liking it. Did you do Walking Dead, Yoko, or no? Um, I watched up until Glenn, probably mm. or shortly after. That's a lot of people. Yeah. And then that's a lot of people's answer. Yes, yeah. I did till Glenn yeah. and then that yeah. was it. Yeah. yeah. But um, we break down a lot of stuff. I know he was going to watch mm -hmm. Avatar. I said how much I loved it. So. Yeah, what's up, Zap? He just celebrated a, a birthday as well, so happy birthday, Zap. Uh, let's see. Uh, Steve Morrow. Did I do that? No. Steve is in the house. What's up? Tokyo Yoko is back. Yes. Uh, <laughs> Vader's Ugg, what's up? Welcome back. Showing the love for the mechanics in the house. When you lose, Tommy. Um, yes. <laughs> Irish Last Yoko from Clan McCann. Love it. Yes, Theo Ernie is so ungrateful. What did I do now? I just started. <laughs> what was I ungrateful for? Yeah. Jesus Christ, Renzu. What's up, Mike? Arizona Toy Hunters Guild. Remember to follow him on YouTube as well. Has some brand new uh, reviews up. And his hunting videos are always great. Of course, he lives in Neverland like me and Dario say. Because it's unbelievable what the bro has found. So everybody went crazy for Street Fighter figures the other day. Because Bison and Dalsum dropped. Toy Migos has the reviews up. You already go check that out if you haven't already. I'm sure you have. Everybody was hit hard with FOMO. And Mike finally felt what we felt when he posts all his videos because he wasn't <laughs> finding the Street Fighter. And I was like, bro, now you know how it feels when you're just like cruising through your store or outside on the side of the road and all these figures are just there. Like who knows where they come from. I said, now you know. Then he gets off work and he finds them immediately. 
And he's like, oh, <laughs> never mind. They're right here. Yeah, no, it's like. So you filled Jesus it for half a day. <laughs> yeah. I was like, are you serious, dude? And then not only that, I think Mikey's found like four sets. So the homies are covered. Everybody had like, for reals. I, I just don't. Wow. Seriously, Neverland out there. Um, Evil Diva's in the house. What's up? Welcome back, Yoko. Yeah, we need to. What's up, Chamba? 90% is good. It is. It is. We need 120% Yoko back, though, but we'll take that. Oh. <laughs> yeah. We will. Hi, Chamba. How are you? Uh, let's see. I need to see this. Do I need to proofread it now, Sonic? Now I feel like I need to proofread it. Now. Okay, I was going to ask you while I was in Japan if you can help me out and grab me some green ball joints for some projects that I've been trying to finish. <laughs> but I, what's green ball joints? I don't what's even that? know what that means. <laughs> I don't know what that means either. Hmm. Yeah, what is that? What does that mean? Is that a code word or something? <laughs> or no, I feel like that's a code word. Yeah, I don't think. So. I don't know. Right? Okay. <laughs> Brownie Jacob G. What? <laughs> Sorry, you know, I think Ernie won the slow mo. I thought we were. I thought we were homies. Thank you, Jacob. I appreciate that. I worked hard. <laughs> I did. Shout out to my crew for helping me. I was, um, I'd seen yours today, right? And I was like, oh, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. And then I told immediately, we were working on a job. And so I told Saul, the younger, my younger crew, uh -huh. he, uh, he reminds me of my son because he's the same age as, as my youngest son. Mm -hmm. And I was like, bro, I need a slow mo video like this. He's like, I got you. I was like, yes. <laughs> so we got back and did it because I didn't know how to do it. And I didn't want to yeah. tell you like what I had up my sleeve. And then right. so um, we shoot it and everything. And I was like, I need a song. And my favorite right now is, um, oh, and I, I can't sing it because the other song's going on in my head. I'm Vanilla Baby. I ain't no killer. Oh, but yeah. Baby. Yeah, yeah. That's my jam right now. But then. <laughs> uh, uh, but but then um santiago walks by and he's just like oh nah dude we, we what have we been bumping today you, you gotta you gotta do uh what's her name the song that i chose that's his favorite right uh, now we were doja that today. Who it was? doja yeah doja yeah. he's like you know you gotta do doja and i was like yes and as soon as <laughs> it was immediately as i clicked it that was the part that came on and i was like yeah. there it is perfect it's right there yeah, yeah we were all proud we were all like, yeah, at the end of the day, <laughs> we were all, yes, we nailed that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh it was, it was great. That's so, that's so funny. <laughs> yeah, it was great. Uh, I John was thinking Hushido, helped you, but I feel like this is even better that you had no, work. No, it wasn't. I was at, yeah, I was at work. <laughs> it was my crew we were throwing down today because I showed them because I was all day. I mean, I get to work way early in the morning and then I don't get off till late. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It was great. Look at you, uh, Larry. Larry in the chat. My cat crammed himself <laughs> in a box a moment ago, too, Larry. Yeah, See, everybody's so cat does it. Well, stop saying his name. He went away. Jake Peterson. What's up, mijo? Mm -hmm. How are you? Jake is back. Jake's been uh, doing the family thing for a while, getting mm -hmm. things taken care of. What's up, Jake? Welcome to the show. Thank you for being here. Yes, that was Rensu. That is classic. You can't just Larry. announce your back, though. You have to do a slow-mo video. That's yeah, you're gonna have to do a slow mo video. <laughs> Did you not see the trend? He's, he's still catching yeah. up. Yeah, that's Jake's true. still catching up. He'll that's see true. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Marcus Yee, I relate to Larry right now. Once Come on, into some nudes. Yeah. <laughs> will you will you let us uh, with the the final question, Marcus? Can you please? Is oh, that gonna happen question? today? We'll get it today. Yeah, Katie, Katie. Japan, but make it slow mo. <laughs> Yoko, yeah. yeah, it was great. <laughs> Uh, let's see. We there's Dario, our man on the street. The Koza Federation hit that like. Tell a friend. Tell the world. The Fallen Fed Chronicle. The Fallen. The Fallen. I've messed it up. Damn it. The mm -hmm. Federation hit the like. Tell a friend. Tell the world. The Fallen Fed Chronicles is on right now. That's right. What's up, Dario? I hope you're having a great day. You know what it is? Is I haven't had a drink yet. I I think that calls for a drink right now. Like Tonight's episode thing? is brought to you by Chi Chi's. Mexican mudslide. <laughs> I'm telling you, it wasn't a joke. Chi Chi's for a dollar is my thing right now. Uh, I'm in love with Chi Chi's for a dollar. It was pina colada. Mm. I've been trying to look for a larger bottle than these things, but these are great too. There's so much alcohol in them. Corinne's like, they? whoa, yes. Mm -hmm. And then um, I went to Winco, and Winco has like this little shipper outside, and they have different flavors. So I uh -huh. got my pina colada, 
but I also got some Mexican mudslide. Mm. I mean, it straight got chocolate syrup in it. And <laughs> yeah. that's, oh, this is so good. Mm. You guys go grab a drink. What are you drinking right now? It's, uh, it's everybody. Water. Y- yes, you need fluids. <laughs> you No, you're not drinking tonight. <laughs> Death by Plastic, what's up? Welcome to the show. Bad Wolf Media is here. I think that Paul reaction was from Monday's revelation that Ernie didn't know it goes out. It was. Yeah, please go watch the repeat of Boba Squadron and learn how somehow I got in trouble and it even wasn't me. But but, oh. but it was it was still you. <laughs> it was me after, but I guess it was just a preemptive me. I don't I don't know. No, you like yes. you like doubled down and made it worse. I you had it I out did. and you made it worse. I yeah. did make it worse. Yeah. Marcus, E, yes, I'm a huge Ghostbusters fan. Um, so been watching it this weekend and at night when we this can. Weekend? Yes, that's why we're going tomorrow. And I'm oh, like, I thought you said oh. you're seeing Die Hard. No. Which die I was confused hard. about. Which I was confused about, but I swear you said Die Hard. Did I say Die? No. You, chat, did he not say that? I said that I was going to go see Die Hard? I swear that you did. And I was like, I don't know. I, I just assumed there was some kind of like, re, you know, re-release really? or something that I didn't know uh, about. We'll see. No. Maybe someone will back me up in the chat. Or, you I know, I think was... Nick, so. <laughs> oh, that's I strong. swear you said Die Hard, though. But it's so good. It's like chocolate milk. No, like a, 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 like a Wendy's Frosty, but yeah. with alcohol in it. Whew, I just have to adjust a little bit there. Mm. Damn. Yes, I'm going to go see Ghostbusters Frozen Empire. Been hitting up all week, so that's where we're going tomorrow. Mm. Um, us, uh, Sarlacc, the girls are coming. My other friends are going. It, it's I, I got to watch it. I don't want to. I grew up on Ghostbusters. I, I loved the one that they just did. So, yeah. I, I gotta be there for the premiere. I'm sorry. If, I, if I'm Migos. allowed out, if I'm able to go out in public, I'll try to watch it this weekend so we can talk about it next week. Then. Oh, awesome! Yes. Yeah. Because it was great. Remind folks again when you end this stream, Ernie, about your absence tomorrow. <laughs> I will, Chamba. I will. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for that. Uh, what's up? Where's the vacation photos? What's up, Rick Jones? She, yeah, she will have them. See, look at there's Crumbs right there. Of course, always saying it. Are we super? Are you super behind? I uh, am I really? Oh yeah, you're okay. I'm just trying to get to everybody too. You're yeah. not a Gundam guy yet. What's up, Johnny? Yeah. I know, I know, I know. Uh, let's see, Doombot, Marcus, Chamba, Winger, Lose, Shelf Presence is here. What's up, Shelf Presence? Mm-hmm. Welcome, uh, Chamba, Sonic, uh, Mike, Bad Wolf, Winger, Lose, Russell is in the house. If I miss something, let me know. Uh, Russell's here. Look at love you, Fennec. Now you're being called Fennec as well. Do you have that helmet? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> do I need to do another slow mo? <laughs> oh my god! If we could keep it going with all helmets, yeah. yeah. Because look at Winger Lou said you do have helmets. I do. I have you a do. lot of those helmets. Yeah. Oh yeah, I got a lot of those helmets. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's see, shelf presence. You uh, could use your hard hat. <laughs> I am TJ Williams. <laughs> I hate stupid hard hats. They hurt so much. Oh. oh, here we go. A generous super chat from Alexander. What's up? Hi, Yoko and Ernie. Love that hair flip promo. <laughs> I wish I had hair. So I had to make sure I was covered with the bandana for work. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Alex is out there in Japan right now, leaving yeah. tomorrow for home. Oh. Alex, if you're going shopping, let me know if you see the Luke or the Vader. <laughs> All right. Uh, still in Japan. Be safe. Have a great trip. Uh, fan again. Collectibles is here. Yes. Replay crew. Thank you very much. Herman Muster. Yes. John finally did it. John is in the house. What's up? Uh, shh, I did, though. I thought it was awesome. Oh, because uh, he's watching that. Uh, Side nine is here. What's up? Welcome back, Yoko. Uh, let's see. Tommy K says, just started watching the latest Walking Dead. Still one episode behind. It's good, I guess. Just not super gung-ho. Yeah, it, it's very hard, right? I, I didn't even... Um, what? Look, I, I can't even remember what was before Daryl. We liked Daryl. Daryl was good. It, it was different. 
I didn't like the one that they tried to do before Daryl. And then this, it was kind of, eh. and then me and zap and I started breaking it down for zap. And that's where I was like, okay. And I was telling zap of, I watched it a second time and it came out more clear of watching the episodes a second time. It's like, it, it, it's like what Michonne is going through and, and, and you got to see the next episode. I, cause I, yeah, I don't want to spoil it for you. Give it a chance. Brick something is here. Well, we're always late, so you might be actually be on time. Uh, let's see. Shell presence, we Matt, we logic. If, if I'm missing something again, let me know. Uh, Tommy K is there with the info for Kevin's stuff again. So here it is for you. April 7th, Thor Hill, Thor Hill, like Thor Thor, like Thor and Loki. It's called Thor Hill. Like he lived on top of that hill just north of Toronto. Tons of toy vendors. Paul's there, of course. And now also Cal Dodd, the voice of Wolverine. Yes, X-Men premiered today as well. Uh, Marcus E., if there's a potential player to and buy some variant figure in the work that's black, I might be interested. I'll, I'll pass it on. Okay. See what I could do for you, Marcus. Mm -hmm. I found nothing out here. Check three local targets. Uh, hitting up the East Bay in Sacramento. Good luck to you, Brick Something. I did old school hunting. They're mine right there. I'll show you in just a second. I'm so in love. So in love with them. Um, let's see. Rick Jones, nothing either. Rick something. I'm sorry, guys. Just keep checking. And remember, please, that they are in the electronic. No, well, yeah, electronic session with the Funkos, with the, the Pops and um, some of the. the um, well. Yeah, is that, is that what it's called? The what? I think so. I think they called it like the collector section. Is that what it's called? I think so. Because ours, one of ours yeah. also has NECA in the middle of the toy aisles. And, oh, really? and only one of ours does. So I don't know why that yeah. is. It has yeah. like the stuffed animals and more figures. And then yeah. plus they have all the NECA stuff on the wall. Yeah. And Funko Pops. And then um, the Naratu stuff. The what? Nar Naratu. Naratu. No. <laughs> Namaste. The dude with the orange bandana who's like a ninja chain, he says, that, is, that dude. That yeah. They got him in the back. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Green ball joints are joints for the knees and elbows on figures, like for scratch builders, hobbyists. Oh. Okay. I didn't know that. I didn't know you could just pick it up like that. Yeah. Jack Harlow. Uh, Jay Carlo is, yeah. I'm vanilla, baby. I ain't no killer, but that's my jam right now. <laughs> uh, that song gets people going. Yes, it does. I love it. Uh, let's see. The what? Because I'm not talking right? The Forlorn Fort Chronicles? Is that what's going <laughs> on, Loki? Loki, welcome to the show. That just means I need to drink more. Mm. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Marcus Yee said, that's a drink? Why did I think that was a sauce bottle? It's true. Because it's that small. Uh, let's see. Rick Dom is here. I'm just here to say if Ernie goes to sexually entice all of us live or not. Again, like super book? chats. Super yeah. chats can get you such a long Ooh, way with me. Super chats, guys. It you might even live, live it might talk. even be <laughs> if Chamba can make me eat a Twinkie with a Vienna sausage for super chats, you might see the sexy. You did that for I'm like drinking. five dollars too. It did not take what? much. Are you serious? I don't remember. Look at right. Tommy K is backing you up. Oh, yeah. Ernie totally said die hard, but wasn't sure if he meant die hard fret. Oh, okay. Maybe I did like that, like, because we're diehards and I didn't get to finish, of course. Maybe. I think. Maybe. 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 <laughs> oh, look it. We'll never know. Johnny said it too. Yeah, lots of people are saying that I said die hard. Maybe I didn't finish all the way. <laughs> you didn't finish your sentence. Okay, that will said he said he was you. going with some of his diehards in that a friend group. Said? That's okay. Mm -hmm. That sounds more like it. Yeah. <laughs> Busted makes me feel good, Rick Jones. Watch the video. Uh, mm -hmm. let's see. Not sure if he said it, but I'll be diehard for nuggies. <gasps> I need some nuggies. I haven't had anything. Ernie, where's the merch page for this channel? <laughs> Grumps your ass. Yeah. yeah. Weird. All this has been talked about. I, I swear to God, you guys. And, and Yoko. Keeps me up on it. Corinne's always yeah, telling which, me to shoot stuff. Mean, Ernie talks about it and is waiting for me to set it up for him. That's, no. what he means. That's what he means by we've talked about it. We need, 
Okay, ninety eight percent of the time, mostly. But I wish like, somebody uh, would set up a merch store for us. <laughs> You're right, Grumps. I don't know who could do it, <laughs> but I mean, the people keep asking for stuff. Yeah. I'll try my best. Yeah. I'll see. Rick Jones says he's so yeah. behind. Sorry, I'm yeah. trying here. Yeah. Oh, that was it. The Negan and Maggie one. I couldn't feel that, especially oh, not after Negan everything. That's weird. There was. And oh. I, I tried and I couldn't. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, X-Men 97 was pretty good. I'm going to have to do that this weekend. Hmm. Oh, Thornhill. It's not Thor. <laughs> I'm all over here with, with uh, Thor. I thought it was. Uh, let's see. The collector's fought. Uh, none of the stores have them in Florida. Yeah, the just, actually, that section just, of Target. Just wait, guys. Just wait. Cat is here. What's up, Cat Chin? Thank you for being here. Uh, let's see. Brick something. Toy Rensu. John. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anybody. Say what's up. I know we usually go through you guys, but we have a lot to catch up on. Lots going on. Brad is here. What's up? Uh, very generous super chat from South Carolina. Woo! Show us the goods, Ernie. What's five get us? It's time for Wednesday Wiggle. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me think of something, Shell Presence. You definitely got it. Thank you for the generous super chat. It really helps out the show. And thank you to all the members. Uh, we have that cut at the beginning. We haven't had time since we were gone. That's why it kept showing like that. But I do have it. Um, uh, uh, Scott Solo, the artist Scott Solo over there from Starlight Digest, made it up for me. And it is able to be, um, what's that, um, added with new members and everything. So thank you for everybody who is a member to the channel oh, yeah, and definitely. doing that. Yeah, yeah there yeah. is stuff. Um, and I don't think we have much going on this weekend. So there will be a bunch of house cleaning and getting stuff back in order and uh, everything. So there we go. I think we got everybody. Thank you for that. I will come up with something for Wiggle Wednesday for you, Shelf Presence. <laughs> Absolutely. I love Wiggle Wednesday. That's dope, huh? That's the thing. But yes, so we got a lot going on. There was trailers, The Acolyte. Um, I know we'll break it down in Boba Squadron, but mm -hmm. what did you think? You know, I need to watch it again because I watched it half asleep on my phone. So, and I meant to rewatch it on a bigger screen, and I haven't yet. I haven't watched it on the bigger screen either. It's been a phone yeah. for me. I saw it twice because yeah. I do want to do that too. I know it's on Disney Plus. Yeah. Um, super excited about the way that it looks. Today we had news from Hasbro, though, and then, of course, I'm biased, so then I just got pissed off because there was no announcement of Paul. Um, can you bring up my Instagram? Sure. Because I have the what was announced there, so we can just run through it real quick. Because yeah. I'm not going to be on Toy Migos tomorrow, so oh, I know so that gives us a chance yeah. to talk about um, it. Just, just what went on today. Um, Acolyte, it, well, we said it on because the uh, poster had come out on Monday. I had no idea that poster was that graphic. I didn't even notice that until was it Paul who said it or was it Kevin who said it about the blood? Yeah. On the poster or somebody in the chat said it. I don't remember, but I when I looked at it the second time, I was like, oh holy crap, dude, that's blood. Yeah. So yeah, this is gonna be crazy. Um but I watched it. I, I'm I'm excited for what's to come and to see. It's going to be in June. That gives us time. And then there was a, a Hasbro presentation today. And uh, we got some stuff already from the Acolyte coming. So we'll see. Yes, it's I will talk kind of about. Funny though, right? Wait, do you want to share? The... Are we sharing this? Yeah. It's it's what though? Do you want me to? Oh, I was just going to talk about how, um, like, usually we're like, oh, you know, there's a new show. Where are the figures? Right. And they don't give us the yes. figures till afterwards. But Ooh. like this time, I feel like they over like overcompensated, <laughs> you know, and it's like now the pre-order is before the show. But the problem for like with me, for me, the problem is that like we have no idea who these characters are. Right. Yes. So I, yes. I feel like uh is I, I'm I'm just curious for you know with with my I'm very curious if I'm there's like, this much seems, Jedi it seems, it seems too it seems too early for a pre-order for characters that we don't know anything about you know like right? I feel like launching this with the show would have made more sense in my marketing we, brain but you know we bitch for for anything we honestly do but I feel you on this because of that would we want characters for it yes so I miss Force Fridays. But again, this is just a pre-order. So we're technically not going to have them when the show goes. I think yeah. that does make a difference if they were 
on the shelf if they were immediately. Yeah. Uh, okay. Street Fighter, for example. On the shelf when the show started, right? But all the pre orders for Dalsam and Bison went up, and all of a sudden, people started finding them at Target. That was crazy. That's a crazy feeling. It's crazy cool to go in the store, hunt them, and find them. And then all of a sudden, they're there for you. It, it's a separate feeling. So to see these Acolyte figures and what they tried to show us was um, very cool. Um, yeah, I have multiple pictures on these, so we can go through them all. Um, here are the characters that that we have. And they're coming with cloth goods. The only thing, which is the robes, we should have had that for a while now, right? Um, is still, to me, like the lack of accessories. Mm -hmm. Sorry, guys. I was a very Dar Heights. Dar. There it is. Die hard. <laughs> Dar Heights. Die hard. Yeah. Dar Heights. Yeah. Dar Heights. <laughs> let, me, let me drink to that. Dar Hide. I was a Dar Hide. Dar Hide <laughs> Star Wars collector. I was a Die Hard Star Wars collector. And in the last couple of years, I've really toned it back like hard, like super, super mm -hmm. back. I'm only getting what I want. Super back. Yeah. Super back. Mm -hmm. Like I'm um, bringing sexy back. Um, super back. So look at this is a great shot. And I put this in here because of you're giving us you're giving us um cloth ropes. Awesome. Finally. But I'm still seeing the lack to me of accessories. All we have are sabers. Um, it seems the baddie for this one is the girl in the purple. I, I already don't know names. Um, but we, we don't like, why would you know names? They're new characters, you know? I, I know, but I'm saying they're labeled on their, on the boxes yeah, and everything. But... Um, so it, it's exciting to me because we used to go through this for Force Friday and then, and then we didn't know. But it's as me to right now, it's the being older and the price of everything. You know, these yeah. are going to go for close to 30 bucks, I'm sure. I, I'm, I don't know if that's the same for you guys, but as far as our target, our target has them for $28.99. And that is a lot to me. That that comes around to $30. Okay. Um, and the lack of accessories from what else I can get for something cheaper, whether it be a Legends, which I collect randomly as well, or Street Fighter, which is $24.99 that comes with everything. I am getting to that spoiled point, and it's harder for me to say as a conscious level. So let's see, this would be what $125. Plus tax in the store if they were just twenty five, yeah. yeah, right, yeah. But the lack of what I'm getting, for me to say that in our circumstances of the world right now and our spending habits, that's very hard for me to justify on something I don't know. There's mm -hmm. tons of Star Wars collectors out there that are super happy about this, and I'm so happy for you. I, I totally get it because I was in that feeling twenty years ago of collecting three cases of everything of I don't know who this is or what I want in this wave, but I'm going to order three cases of it. Now I'm just a different type of collector. So I'm not putting it down in any type of way. I'm not, I'm, I'm telling you my views as far as collecting for it. No one's arguing. And it has, and it has changed. Oh, there's people yelling at the screen right now. I swear to no, God. No, I no thought you were a Star arguing. Wars fan. No, no uh, one's arguing. Trust me, there is. <laughs> and so with that being said, that's where I stand with this. Was it cool reveals and they're going to be coming? Yes. But do we know how long this kind of takes for right now? Yeah. Ahsoka was out a little bit after the show had ended. That was cool. I I went and grabbed my droid figure and my um, Balin. And then I got hooked up by Diggs Figs with Batty. So I'm yeah. cool with that. Like, that's all I needed. You know, um, that's that was my choice of what I wanted. So that was cool. And on this one. You're right. Instead of me, see, there it is, Rensu. I knew it. <laughs> so with me not knowing this show, I would have been all into it. Oh my God, look at all these brand new Jedi's. We have, is she a Sith? Why is it purple? We don't know what's going on. I'm gonna get it. Now, as me as a collector older, I can't do that now. You're right. I need to see, like, because we don't know, is dude gonna die right there? Like by second episode? I, I can't spend thirty dollars on a dude who's gonna die immediately second episode. And I'm like, you know, now he's just a background figure. So, Boba Fett. But what? No, but with that, it's still almighty. So, yeah, he that's it. Like I said, away. totally yeah. happy for everybody who is all all in on this and was super excited about today. 
totally being biased because Paul is the homie. I feel he deserves a figure. And there was still no figure. Go ahead and go to the next one. So this is what we had for Black Series today. We had the reveal. Cool. Brand new show. Here's figures. Pre-orders uh, go out. Um, they are continuing with these hollow figures. Uh, Darth Maul. Probably will pick this up because I'm totally into bad guys and I love clear figures. But um, I'll pick it up when it goes on sale. I was real close to getting um, Bo-Katan at Target because they had her for 14 on sale. And I'm like, I saw that there was like six on the shelf. So I'm like, uh, you know what? It's going to go lower than that. I'll wait till then. I'm just a sucker for clear figures. So that's why I like this. Ahsoka hasn't shown up yet, right? She was a Walmart exclusive. Uh, yeah, that was an order. So yeah, yeah. orders have I missed, gone out. I missed that one. Okay. I would, I would, I would grab her if I had the opportunity, but I, I missed love, that order. Love bad guys, and here it is. If I see it at Walmart, I'll let you know. Yeah, thank you. Because it's supposed to go out there too. Yeah, um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I, one of your teammates. You know. Maybe oh, absolutely. Part of your team. I, the the whole team out there a, for getting me everybody. <laughs> yes. Uh, I thought you were done with Black Series. I am. That's not. No, I'm very selective. Very, very selective. Paul is totally done with Black Series. He's selling his. Um, Scott is selective. Mooch is here and there, but still gets a lot. Um, so, yeah. I'm just like, and then here is our pipeline. Still no pipeline. We're getting Homegirl from, what's his name? Uh, uh, Andor? I, thank you. I was about to say Alderaan. This truth is really good. <laughs> I <laughs> from to Alderaan. Say <laughs> And then I'm sure this pissed off Paul today. That droid, that that dude is made in the vintage one is made into a black series now too. Yeah. The um, I can't read the screen, so I got to bring it up for my old eyes on my phone. Hold on, bear with me. The bear commando? with me. Yeah. Right. Is that what it is? Commando. Thank you. Yeah. Next I can't. I can't see yeah. nothing. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, yes. The Imperial Armored Commando is getting a Black Series. <laughs> Deidre, that's cool. I like that one. I know, Rensu. I'm sorry. We're getting another Exo Ahsoka from her show. So she's going to be in the white. Ahsoka the White. Yes. And then we're getting a two-pack Walmart exclusive Captain Enoch and a Night Trooper. That's cool. That's awesome. Hate that it's a Walmart two-pack. Walmart's very hard to get on their exclusives. It seems a 50-50 chance on has it gotten better, hasn't it? Then we're getting a comic version, which this was really crazy. Uh, Yoda and Clone Commander Gree, which we just brought up with Kat. Remember that? So yeah. that was funny. I was laughing. Um, but they specifically said, I was when I saw the reveal <laughs> earlier, um, that uh, they, they specifically said that it's going to be a comic version. So I mm. want to see what that's going to look like. Because we were supposed to have gotten target versions of the Clone Wars from um, the cartoon that they say doesn't count, but it was the very first Clone Wars that used to be on Cartoon Network. They were like three minute snippets. Yeah, we were supposed to get figures of that, and I was super excited to see what they were going to do. And instead, it's like we got kind of the cartoon bodies, but they put the regular heads on. I would have oh. liked it to come out more cartoony. Does that well, make sense? Yeah, but this pro it'll probably be like the um, uh, the rest of the. I keep calling it the literary series, and Kev, Kev makes fun of me. The publishing series. Right? Like it'll look like uh -huh. this one, right? It'll be a part of that line, I'm assuming. No? Oh, you're right. Yeah. You're right. So they said that, but it's just going to come in that box. M maybe. I don't know. Like are, if they're still doing their that packaging. Yeah. Right, right, right. So that was it for the pipelines and no reveal of Paul. Not yet. Again. Not yet. They're saving him for something extra special. I just, I know. Well, it. they, okay. Well, they did talk about the brand new HasLab. <laughs> And they oh. send out pictures of the ghost yeah. and saying, don't oh, worry, everything's still good. Sorry, I didn't have time to put those up. No, um, no. This is Disneyland. Oh, that's at Disney. Pause that real quick and we'll go over that real quick. Yeah. Um, Pause? Okay, boomer. <laughs> what was I supposed to say? Can you please hold? Please hold. <laughs> um, they, what, you, look, at you made me lose it. What was I, what was I going on the tangent about? I don't know. Damn the HasLab? Oh, yeah, the HasLab, where we <laughs> said Paula Chance. They said it's going to be a vintage collection HasLab. 
does yeah. that mean we're going to get an X wing and it's going to be Paul? Imagine if Paul's a Haslab. Sorry, Paul, I have a Paul shrine, but I can't spend five hundred on an X wing. I can't. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to go on eBay and find the figure after that. Do you think an X wing would cost as much as the Ghost? I don't think so. Yeah, because yeah, they're going to trick Maybe. it out. Yeah, but it won't be anywhere near as big, would it? Oh yeah, if you're thinking an X wing to well. They, they can totally justify it by giving it different options, right? Imagine yeah. if you could pop off the nose and different parts of it and make it look battle damaged. Imagine yeah. if you can make it look like the scene yeah. from when he lands at yeah. Dagobah. Yeah. You, you, all you have to do is add stuff to it. So if they threw yeah. this in with it, you're technically getting a HasLab X-Wing that should be there. Yeah. But it's giving you an option to make it what you want. So they said it was going to be yeah. vintage collection. Is not there a reason why you series. can get this or are you just willing it to happen? Oh, no. I was just saying that when we said, don't worry, they're going to tell Paul later. I'm like, yeah. well, oh, watch okay. watch okay. him be. And not only an X-Wing, but it's Captain Carson Tava's <laughs> X-Wing. And then I'm going to be like, oh, are you serious? Yeah. I can't do that. So I don't know. That was just my thinking of when you said it's to come. But <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. So Black mm -hmm. Series, that's what we got. That's your pipeline reveals. Mm -hmm. uh, vintage Collection, if you can move up there to the uh, left. Well, we already knew about Leia. You know, Go down one real quick. We'll just go through it. Hit where it says Star Wars Imperial March. Uh, the one next to it, please. Okay, go yeah. through that one real quick. This was earlier, but they gave us at the beginning. Um, we knew that Vintage was getting a new Vader and a uh, Stormtrooper, which is cool. I would like him in building ones, though. You can just flip through these real quick. There's a look at them. Vintage collection. Yay, vintage collectors. Oh, my God. We're so cool. Um, yeah. And then we get Captain Enoch and this uh, set of troopers with the zombie troopers. That's cool. Build your troop with that. This is Black Series. And uh, Cal Kestis and um, a sister and a brother, right? Or no? Oh, that was a, a commander or something, I think. This is a Black Series 3-pack, yeah. which was cool. Are you interested in this one or no? Um, Probably not as much as I love Cal. I don't think I need him in in uh, bad guy gear. No? Undercover. I don't think I need undercover Cal, no. If it goes on sale, yes? Maybe, but, you know, I'm kind of I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm getting away from. You're from, okay. Uh, I'm, right. I'm, I'm saving room for 1-6 scale. Well, I knew you were a, a Cal fan, so I didn't know if you were going to go for yeah, the Inquisitor yeah, set. Yeah, no, yeah, but like, yeah. I hope they make a Cal hot toy at some point, you know? Like, I'd rather have that. <laughs> Dang, check this out. Huh. Joining us late, having a bad day. Obi-Wan Chingonis is in the house. Sorry for being late, y'all. My only comfort after painful days at work. Would love to hear an orale right now. You got it, fool. Orale. There it is for you. We're, we're going to give you your... Orale. <laughs> <laughs> Pop open a You're at home. We're going over some stuff. Take your boots off. Pull up a chair and enjoy. Thank you very much for the super chat. I'm I'm drinking some chichis, fool. I got some chichis Mexican mudslide and it's delicious. I love it. Chichi, send me some stuff. Fuck. All right. Thank you, Obi Wan. Kick back. Come come join us, fool. One more. Orale. Everybody's hearing that, right? Please tell me you're yes, hearing that. I hear okay. it. So Loud stupid if it wasn't. Okay, so we have <laughs> that one. Um, for vintage collectors, <laughs> now we can show the Leia uh, was also uh, Wait, shown real quick. The speculation of wishful thinking I was hearing about the HasLab is the Havoc Marauder uh, with Bad Batch figures. Oh. That's interesting. That is interesting. Because they've, they've only had Hunter, I think, right? I think Hunter's, um, only, Hunter's only one that's is the really only one in vintage collection. Yeah. Really? I'm trying. I'm, to, I'm going through my head of stuff right now. I'm almost positive. Oh wow! I didn't know that. A uh, toy Rensu. Yes, that's why I say it so much. And then I can show you the bottle that I'm not saying it in that way. I'll buy Chi Chi's for a dollar any day. Okay. There we go. <laughs> what did you um, want to next? Leia? <laughs> the Leia. <laughs> the Leia that was next to it. Okay, so we got we're in Leia and R2. Okay. This is Vintage Collectors. Okay. And I get it. This is great for Vintage yeah. Collectors because there's a lot of those now. 
Um, a lot of people are, are going to straight vintage collection. They're even forgetting all about black series. Um, so they have great stuff, you know, coming out and always shown on the streams and what's to come for them. Super clean R2D2 instead of the dirty version. Uh, so, and then the Leia, uh, new hope version. She looks good as well. So, uh, that was shown before, but here were like the card art and everything else. That Chihuahua is getting better. Has a bit of an echo. <laughs> oh, thank you. All right. What, what, the, what, what's he poking at? Poke. Who are we poking, Marcus? What happened? Oh, what happened? What happened? Uh, Did you miss let's see. The second question. I don't know. Oh, is it? He's waiting for it? Yeah, All I right. think so. So Vintage Collectors, like I said, is always having a great turnout on the figures that they could do, has labs, anything else. Um, I think that's cool if it is a um, all of them. I didn't know that there was only one figure released for 99. For Bad Batch? I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Like I think I only have Hunter, but that could... <laughs> what? Oh, are you laughing at Twitter? Marcus Yee, I got it. Yeah, Marcus Yee says... He's poking at Chi Chi's because. <laughs> <laughs> yes, my bad when I drink. I didn't do that. Corinne swears I did. Adam swears I did. Josh swears. Sorry, Cheney swears that I did. I didn't, but they all said I did. So maybe I did. I apologize to you, Dave and Buster's girl. Oh, no. Our food wasn't there. <laughs> Jordan was missing her food. I was missing our food. Isn't this from like two years ago? This yeah. Story? Oh and then God. Kix kept ordering stuff on purpose and would get his stuff brought uh, out. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I Karen'd. Herman Munster knows. He laughs at me because I put my hands to the side like Peter Griffin. And I stood up there with hands to the side. And they all said that I poked the Chi-Chi's and, oh, my God, Ernie, how dare you? And that she flipped out, and I was just full Karen mode, and I didn't even know it. I apologize, Dave and Buster's girl. I apologize. But you should have brought out Jordan her food. And mine. <laughs> and I don't even understand why Marvel oh, kicked. Marvel Kibbs kick ordering it. Okay, go ahead. All right. Uh, so, Vintage Collection, you get that. And then they're also getting, um, if you hit the Acolyte um, one for Vintage Collection, they're only getting two. No, what? this is with the Black Series one, oh, the other one. I was like, what? That one, yeah. I see. They're only no. This is another Black is, Series one. Yeah. Oh, here. Okay, sorry, I got it. <laughs> They're only getting two. They're getting these two characters, yeah. cloth goods. That's cool. Uh, good articulation and vintage. I'm sure they'll put out the other ones. And then yes, as you scroll through this one, look, they they look great. And I don't yeah, even know why do. it looks different. Right? It looks different than the Black Series version. I feel like cosplayers are gonna love her, huh? She looks fun. Oh, very true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I wonder if the purple cloak will be sold in Batu. Yeah. Probably at some point because it looks just like it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, okay. Let's see. Was that it? I think so. And I oh, saw, okay. I saw um, Sonic asked if I collect Black Series. And I do I do have some Black Series. I have a decent amount of mm -hmm. Black Series, but I, but yeah. I specifically collect more Ahsoka Rebels Clone Wars verse and even yeah. then I'm, still, I'm just so particular in general maybe you know, more so these days when they here's herman this <laughs> is this fool has pointed it out to me at work like if i'm going off or something and i look at him and he'll stand like that to mimic me and i have to go <laughs> what are you doing why are you and i look down and i'm like oh shit <laughs> hands are at the waist all right He's got to keep me in check. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesus Christ, John. Yeah, he means business. Oh, there's Saul. What's up, Saul? Saul. They loved our video, bro. And they think <laughs> I did even better than Yoko. He did. Mission accomplished. Me the shame. <laughs> <laughs> and Saul was pissing me off today, but then he totally redeemed himself. So there we go. Oh. <laughs> Customs by Matthew is in the house. Who else did I see? Uh, Ooh, Machu Toy lucky. is here. Are mm -hmm. you guys done? Uh, say what's up to what does that say? Oh, that it was say? something else. Sorry, <laughs> it did a lot of work to do. I saw my name in <laughs> a many, comment. How many picks? Honest, 
I'm I'm a one take baby. <laughs> I am. I am. I am. One Ask her in. Yeah. Cheney loves it too. <laughs> People swear to God <laughs> that I do so. So <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, it was, Herman. You shut your mouth. Was this another project yeah. on your sanction break? Are you yes, sure it you was. want to put that up? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was. Possible. It absolutely was. Mm. You can check my paperwork. Okay, uh, and then uh, rounding mm. it out was a uh, Moff Gideon uh, bucket that's going to be yeah. coming. Lights up, uh, cool. everything. It is very cool. I might have to. Um, I might have to get this one. Yeah, it looks cool. I, I don't. Like I don't it. need it, but it's pretty cool. I feel like when I'm upset, I want to throw this on. That, that's just like what. <laughs> and I then feel do like. a slow mo video of taking it off. And then do a slow mo. <laughs> Get, it, get all the I'm behind on my helmets. There. I need. I want to get. I need to get the Captain Rex helmet. I was hoping I could get it for eighty bucks. We'll see. Yeah. Yeah. And then the Sabine one. I forgot about. I haven't pre-ordered the Sabine helmet, but I need. I'm gonna have to get that one too. The Sabine helmet. Wasn't there a Sabine helmet pre-order? Or did I? Is that a fever dream I had? I have a Bo-Katan. I don't have a Sabine. No, but it's, it's still on pre-order. It hasn't released yet. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't remember that. <laughs> Did I pre-order it? <laughs> Am I making it up? No, it exists. I don't know. Mandela effect in full effect. <laughs> um, Scroll down a little bit, please, because I had... Check all the Leia ones. Did we go through all the Leia ones next to that Star Wars Imperial March? Yes, that one. Go through that one for me real quick. Leia R2, Leia R2. There we go. Acolyte. Boom, boom, boom. Looks at those. Uh, those are going to be oh, everywhere. Here we go. Okay. Yeah. Their yeah. vintage pipeline reveals were really cool. Let me find it so old man can read it. Old man Fett over here. I can read it. Um, the Tech Trooper. Yes. Grand Admiral Thrawn from Ahsoka. If you see that, I would say pick it up. I would get a Thrawn. I will get yes. Thrawn. Hold, uh, um, hold a Thrawn for a rainy day. Uh, four pack of X-Wing pilots. Looks like OT. Could that be Paul? And it looks like OT. I That's know. Leia. Oh, oh, the picture? Yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah. <gasps> Would we get Cliff? I'd buy it if we get Cliff. Do you know what I'm talking about? No. Okay. So Why? here's a little background fact for you. Right there in the shot and other shot is Cliff from Cheers, who also does oh. the Pixar movies. Because I watched Cheers. I know. That's well, <laughs> but he's Pixar as well, too. Yeah. So oh, here's our fact checker in full effect right now. Cat Chit yeah. says there I is a Sabine Black series helmet I coming. I think I made it up. Okay. All right. I'll have to see. What? He's not an X-wing pilot. He's in the shot. What was he? Just a mechanic? Isn't he in? What do you mean by Wait. just a mechanic? <gasps> I think she's right. <laughs> I'm no. I'm trying to place everybody on the base. Damn Wait, it! Where's, where's that one comment? We're not going to get a cliff. Where's that one comment? Uh. So yeah, he's in every Pixar film too to do his voice. He's a major, major asshole. Sorry, <laughs> that's Spaceballs humor for you. I love it. What can I find the <laughs> comment? Oh wait, I found it. Where'd it go? There. <laughs> I thought you were Star Wars fan. I was confused and I'm drinking. Sorry. There you go. Just go to Streamyard. Yeah, you just open the stream yard, baby. Come on in. <laughs> um, Doombot got it. Thank you. I'm a Star Wars fan. I'm surrounded by assholes. Uh, okay, so a four pack of X-wing pilots. So no Paul. Imagine if they digitize Paul um, into yeah, the movies. Unless, unless it's a red herring. Yeah. Uh, a, a Disney Plus. A Disney did does oh, a Lucas. Just, yeah. <laughs> would, and adds people I'd be on in. Board. Yeah. Yeah, I would too. I'd be like, yeah. yes. <laughs> How many assholes do we have on this ship? <laughs> I mean, have that's a that Spaceballs? sounds like a Paul line, right? Yes, it is. Have you not seen Spaceballs? I have not. 
Why? I've, I've barely seen Star Wars. Let's be honest. <laughs> okay, that's true. You're you're right. That's that's very true. All right. <laughs> Cat says he's the one who orders the Echo Base doors closed. Cat is a true fan. Jesus Christ. Yeah, she, now she is a Star Wars fan. Yes. <laughs> yeah wow but she just she's yelling at the screen at me all the time yeah, okay well, we all are yeah <laughs> and then we're let's see uh we're getting a blurg and a mando uh-huh that's a cool set if they come out like a vintage little box set to sell it people would buy it yeah <laughs> funny she doesn't look druish <laughs> and then they like to do their little sets their little, their little, um, little play sets. Play, yeah, their their play sets. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> our man on the street, floating head Dario. Oh man, that sounded weird. Uh, what's up, my man? What's going on, guys? How are you? I'm all right. You really are floating. <laughs> he is. I love when he does that. <laughs> did you see the trailer for the Acolyte or no? No, I did not. Okay. Did you see the new trailer for Alien? No, I did not. I heard I about either. it was supposed to come out, but what I'm waiting for is the Beetlejuice trailer, and it keeps getting pushed back because of everything else. So it was supposed to come out, what's today, Wednesday? It was supposed yes. to come out Monday, then they pushed it back to yesterday. Then they yes. said it was going to be today, but they were like, maybe not because there's so many trailers that came out today, supposedly. So they're like, maybe tomorrow? So I don't even know. There was a but leak got, today. We got an image, yeah. We got an image of him in suit and costume. So, and and uh, then uh, we got. Um, is Beetlejuice? It's supposed, is it supposed to be a um, a sequel? Yeah. Yes. It's a uh, Keaton back. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Keaton's back. Lydia's back. The yeah. mom is back, and then the daughter is played by what's her name? Who did Wednesday? Right. And there that's was. Right, that's right. I did hear that. Or read there that. was a leak today. Of showing her leaving the house and riding her bike down the street, and then she turns down the bridge, and I was fangirling so hard, and I was screaming at work, "Oh my god, oh my god, there it is!" And then it cut off, and I was like, "Oh, um, I'm I'm super excited for it." Who was that? Entertainment Weekly who showed the pictures, right? Uh, I don't I don't know. I just saw it. I was scrolling through. Um... Twitter oh, and okay. I saw it real quick. I, I wasn't like too much on my phone. I tried to tag yeah. uh, Marco on the stuff I posted and nothing yeah. worked. I think only one worked and I was like, I don't know what I did, bro. My pudgy thumbs. Uh, uh, I think that Mucho Mucho. <laughs> I mean, I want to talk tonight. So excited about everything. Moocher and Scott got the pictures though and then just reposted. Yeah. Because yeah, they, they knew you were them. trying. I sent it to okay. them. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, mucho, you know, <laughs> moocher. Uh, yeah, this is a good one. Tommy wants to know: Can you please say "Mecca like a high, Mecca high me ho"? Yo, I was trying to think of what it was, and I couldn't remember. And then I saw it, and I was like, "Oh, that's what it was." Hey guys, today's word is Star Wars. You know what happens when somebody says Star Wars? <laughs> hey, wasn't his name Chamba? That I thought about it right now. Is it? Make oh. a wish. Make a like a high, make a hiney ho. I love it. Um, okay. So there's an alien trailer. Amazing. It looks super good. What did you guys think of the alien trailer? Dario will have it posted up later tonight. Um Dario is the new Zordon. <laughs> Rangers. I don't want, I don't want. No teenagers. I'm watching that, <laughs> that Dan Schneider four episode thing and nah. <laughs> oh shit. He's oh it's Jombie. I thought it was Chamba. Sorry. <clears throat> From Pee Wee's Playhouse. Yeah. Mecca like a high, Mecca Heine Ho. <laughs> um we have a very generous super chat from Mark. Ernie, let's let's see a hair flip from you and Yoko. <laughs> And Dario's here now too. So Dario, Dario yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, my hair is all well, you can't see it, but you can't see your hair. We're gonna imagine that I have hair and I'll go ahead. So what I did was it was hot, it was right after work. 
Yoko thought she was running the show of I'm back and she took off her helmet <laughs> and then it was all fantastic. I was like, she's like, yo, I think Yoko messed up and this might be the young fans or something. <laughs> <laughs> Posted the wrong video. What is I was like, what is I'm like, I don't feel right even watching this. <laughs> as soon as it went slow, Dario yeah, said, oh, yeah, shit. Like, okay. oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, <laughs> shit. Okay. Yoko. And somebody already, Sonic Rock Van X already said, sexy video, Yoko. <laughs> here's, here's, here's Dario on a break. Oh, Yoko. Yoko. Ah. No, you know what? Know. You know. Dario posts videos of himself in the shower, but oh, I post <laughs> one slow mo hair flip. Hey, hey, hey. I did the shower video for y'all, you did it for the whole world to see. <laughs> <laughs> and I lost five followers after posting it. <laughs> you, you know what it looked like? It looked like, um, like if it was like a, a parody movie, right. And like it's all, it's all like let's say let's just, it's all like guy stormtroopers, and you're like that one girl stormtrooper when you take the helmet off, and like yeah. the in the parody movies when it's slow motion and you see like yeah. the background all hazy and shit. And yeah. Like, and then the hair falls like out. Like the wind. You should have had a fan like blowing in your hair. Like, <laughs> they're like, yo, it's mad windy in Yoko's room. <laughs> she, she have a window open. What's there going must on? There be a draft. <laughs> yeah. that, that is great. Funny. That funny. Yeah. All right, That's everybody's funny. been asking for Wiggle Wednesday and everything. So yeah, I was there and I was like, no, Yoko's not going to be the star of the show. This is the Fallen Fett Chronicles tonight. So I caught off yeah. and jumped Ernie, out of my Ernie, truck. Fighting. Ernie, Ernie's uh, fighting for his show. <laughs> got in and I said, I can do it too. I took <laughs> off my hat and I said, yeah. You had to do the whole the whole ambiance of it. Did but you see me? I even, I even eyed the camera. If you could see it in the corner of my eye, I was, I was making love to the camera, I was like that. There it was. So there, here, here you go, Mark and everybody else tonight. Here we go. It was like this. <laughs> there it is. That's mine. That's, that's my that, that's edition. The parody. That's the parody. You start off with Yoko, and then it ends in you, like shirtless, all sweaty, <laughs> in the hair. In yeah. The hair <laughs> Yeah, that's what it is. It's like okay, a construction we'll, site parody. We'll, re we'll recut this. Yeah. <laughs> Waking up on a Sunday morning. And I'm all. <laughs> all right, you go hair flip. You got to do it. Oh my God. It's the Wiggle Wednesday. I, I can't. How many takes did you do then? It probably it took me a few. I mean, I so I like I did not film this today. I filmed that a few a few weeks ago. I think when I when I did the unboxing of the helmet. Oh, but um, huh. I kept getting stuck in the mic, you know, at first. Oh, so it, it would so hit it, you? Like, it would get caught in my hair. So it took me a couple of tries to, like, adjust it properly. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Yo. Okay, hair flip. You got to do a hair flip. Hair flip. I don't need, I don't. It's like, if I think about it, I don't know how to do it. I know. It's Yoko's super hard. Like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, my neck. Oh, my neck. <laughs> yeah. Pretend yeah. it's slow mo. Okay. Yeah. She did the. She did the. Can you help me? <laughs> See, there it is. Yeah. I'm sorry. Can you help um, me over yeah. here? Yeah. I don't know, but is there a Star Wars section? All right. <laughs> Go, Dario. Do you know what a Star it, Wars? Yeah. It's like you know. I know, like <laughs> girls. I know it's not like for girls, but like I kind of like want to like it. You know. <laughs> Please, do you have anything? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you would do it in a second for shower, Bucky. Look at that's what, what Marcus just put. <laughs> no way. Everybody knows. She's like, oh well, shower, Bucky, and I gotta talk to him. Oh my god, no, I would be like running in the other direction. Let's be honest. Thank you so much, Zap. I greatly appreciate that. And we also have one from Alexander. I think you got super chat messages before now. That's true. We did. And that's why. We we did we that that was your wiggle Wednesday and we broke it down. We just didn't didn't go through it. That was good. Yeah, I know we I know I I messaged you yes last week when I mean not last week I think it was though the Boba Squadron. But did you guys watch Avatar? I haven't seen y'all since, so I, that's why I'm asking now. So apologies for going back. Bless you. 
did we what? Oh, watch the cartoon we, version yeah. yet? No, no. D- did you watch the series first? Yes. Yes. Have y'all watched I, the animated show yet? No, I haven't had a chance. I watched the I series started. twice. Mm-hmm. Oh, you did start. Nice. Okay. Okay. So, Yoko, where are you on the animated series? Oh, shoot. This was before my trip, but I got to, like, my first arc that they kind of, that they skipped for the live Season action. one, though? Yeah, yeah. Still season one. Okay. So, yeah. I, I put in the Bobo Squadron that it was great, but I only gave it an 8.5, right? Mm-hmm. The reason, and I say, I, I, I'll tell you guys, because I say to watch the animated show. I didn't, re- like, the show itself is dope. And it's kind of like on par with the animated show. If you now that you when you watch it, you can see like, oh, these parts, you know, like are similar, right? Okay. I didn't realize how important like the animated show, I guess, filler episodes are. Mm-hmm. And if you watch the last episode of the other uh, uh, live action show, I'm I'm I, well, what it's not spoilers. It's been out for a minute now, right? So. If you yeah. didn't watch it, fuck off. Um, <laughs> the last episode, you get uh, Momo basically sacrificing himself, right? And they bring him back to life at the end in the in that water, the lake, mm-hmm. uh, the uh, Simitanka, whatever, right? Where those Prince, the be? water from Lake Minnetonka. Minnetonka, yeah, yeah. They, when they revive him in that, right? You mm-hmm. don't, we don't. I don't. I didn't care for that because you don't know who Momo is that much in the live action show compared to the animated series right they have those episodes where they show like like his backstory type of shit and so the same thing with appa another thing was when the 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 joke at the end when uh 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 what's his name god damn i hate these guys uh not not zuko uh the the other the brother yeah what's the I Whatever, yeah. Anymore. I knew and it. Then he was like, oh, let's get some food. And then they're like, yo, you're always thinking about food. I'm like, y'all never mentioned that he's always eating in the show. Mm-hmm. It's like stupid little things like that that you're like, ah, I felt flat. Like, again, I'm not comparing it to the animated <laughs> series, but yeah, yeah, yeah. at the yeah. same time, it's like, yo, I never realized how much those stupid filler episodes were, like, compared to, like, I guess. That's oh, when shows. you see it played out of them trying to do That's a show, the whole yeah. thing, right? Like, I think yeah. any show you would have that though, where people complain about filler episodes, you know. And Paul's gone off about this on Boba Squadron before, but like filler episodes really aren't filler, right? Like they really do add to character yeah. development that you maybe don't realize that you're getting. But like they could have kept that joke crazy. out, like the whole mm-hmm. yo, you're always thinking about food. Like you could have kept that out. You didn't need that. Mm-hmm. Again, like not once do you hear this guy always like. And any episode saying like, yo, let's get something to eat. I'm hungry. You know, <laughs> like he literally said that like the end of the show and it's like, eh, whatever. Uh-huh. But other than that, bro, yo, I am so excited for season two and three. Yeah. I can't yeah. Wait. Yeah. That's and awesome it, that they announced the two, you know, two seasons. Yes. Two more seasons of it. Yeah. Gives yeah. You, because well, that gives people more reason to go back and watch season one too, right? Like maybe they were on the fence about mm-hmm. watching it all. And now they're like, okay, yeah. I'm getting three seasons. I, I can invest now. Yeah, 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 all yeah. super cool characters and everything. And then too, I never knew what the title stood for until you watch it. And I was like, ah. Right, okay. didn't I say that? And I was like, <laughs> Yeah, you oh. did. Like I yeah. I understand now what the last yeah. airbender means. It's like that moment is so yeah. shocking. Yeah. And then not knowing either, like mm-hmm. who's bad guys and who's that. Like mm-hmm. me and Corinne were watching it the whole time, like, oh, oh no, he's a bad guy. <laughs> yeah. 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 I don't think I'm gonna like this. We'll yeah. see what happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That that mm-hmm. was that was crazy. What's up, Felipe? No, um, have not seen X Men yet uh, this weekend. Mm-hmm. Um, I watched yeah, the new Bad I Batch. Watch either. I try. Okay, again, I tried to watch Bad Batch again today at the end of the day during my break, and it was another dark episode in lots of places that I don't know how Kevin did it. As far as Kevin always saying that I watched on my phone, oh, that shit is dark. Like I can't see nothing on the. It's it's Dario floating head. It, it really is. And, and then they like- all um no Dario no wait oh. okay he's Marlboro Marlboro lights. He's a fan of. Um, <laughs> that scared me so bad right now. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, no, it's a good show. Don't get deleted. We can still see you. 
you put the phone uh, down we can still see you I, I thought so never mind i thought something was gonna happen we're all good fine. baby it's fine. All, no i can see you're good go back go back to fuji la there there you go all right no no spoilers cat it was just dark what i mean is when you're trying to watch on like a the phone screen was dark yeah yeah there's nothing but going on all i can do is I hear the voices either cat so don't worry yeah so all, all good that's that's what i'm saying is i, I can't what believe TVB? the bad batch oh the bad batch. yeah oh star wars got it cat you're good <laughs> i hope she read that okay there we go so yeah it's just because it's dark mm -hmm. meaning i can't see nothing on the stupid phone so i had to listen to everything so mm -hmm. yeah dang alexander Thank you. Super sticker. I can't see it on my end. Yoko, what is it? <laughs> I'm going to go look at it. Oh, it's a spoiler alert sticker, but we are not spoiling anything. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. No spoilers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because mm -hmm. I know it just came out today. Um, But, yeah, I, I'm, I'm enjoying that, so that's good. But, Dario, yeah, there is, and I <laughs> saw it earlier. I didn't know. There's a new Alien trailer, if you can put it up later. But somebody said there's a long version one. I don't think oh, I, I saw that know. long version one. Aliens continuing on. It's called Alien. Yeah. What's it called? Alien something. Um, I'll, I'll, yes. I'll find it. Mooch is right. Oh, is In 30 the minutes. The, the Fast and Furious. The Fur Romulus. Furoso? Romulus. There you go. Yes. Uh, Fast what's and the Furioso. Furioso. What's the Furioso Alien? one? Alien Furioso? I don't know. <laughs> Romulus is it supposed to be Moochers, right? Coming up in just 30 minutes with the Sarlacc Digest, we will fully be breaking down that episode with 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 spoilers. Uh yeah, uh Romulus is the next alien movie. It looks crazy. That end scene, if you haven't seen it, I, I had a mouth open reaction. Literally, they showed something and I was just like, Oh, are you serious? I didn't know that. Oh, wait, what? Brick something says Furiosa that has the two ver Oh. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> you were right, Dario. <laughs> I thought you were no, trying to rhyme something stuff, with that. <laughs> there was a lot of stuff that came out this week. That's why. So I, I see why they keep pushing that Beetlejuice back because they don't want to get it lost in the sauce, you know? That's a that's a big yeah. one to drop. You don't want to just dump that with anything. Thank you, Chamba, so much. I love you. I can't thank you enough. I was just Chamba's the man. I throw note. Yeah, I throw notes out there. All the time. Ask. I can't ask wait to get Chamba drunk again at San Diego. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see it this time. Yeah, Romulus. Yeah, looks if you don't leave, super Stick good. Around. Yeah, I, I will. I promise. I will. I promise. Um, <laughs> Romulus looks so good. I got scared in this trailer. I know it is early. I don't want to spoil anything for you guys. The very last shot had me mouth open. I couldn't believe it. I did want to talk about Beetlejuice. We know it's that. That was just a, a um, the scene that I saw was just a little snippet of it. And it got me that excited and seeing the picture. The only thing I didn't like, and I think it seemed like, I don't know, Dario, what did you think? The behind the scene picture, I thought his hands were discolored as well, too. Because in the picture, it shows his flesh hands. Yeah, it's probably not like a full costume thing. It was just like a Look at this like a behind it's... the scenes, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah, think that's it was what I like had a, thought too. Like, um, like off the like the movie thing or something. It was probably just like him coming out of makeup or some. Yeah. Okay. But I, dude, I can't wait for that, man. He'll leave and blame all of you for abandoning him. That's about. That's about I'm, you. Yeah. I know, and I will make yeah. a point. I will be sticking yeah. around for all everything. I will yeah. call Ubers. I will. Stick. I'm gonna make sure. I'm. I'm gonna. I'm probably gonna take uh, one of those uh, telephone cords that people like to tie up their kids with in the parks, and whoa, I'm gonna whoa. have that on me. Easy yeah. Stay there, pal. The what are those called? You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> they put it know, on their but kids. I don't know they what they're called. <laughs> nah, I never. I don't tie up no kids, man. No, no, no. Where they don't run away. <laughs> that one. I will. I'm going to stay. I swear to a God. Leash? It's like a leash. I didn't want to say a leash. Anyway. A lot of people use are you it. talking about that retractable bungee cord thing that they be having with the straps? Like they look like, like yes. they're literally pets, like dogs? Yes. That if they run people, away, like you can stop it? People have that in the parks for their kids. And I'm always like, dang, because you see the kid get choked. Ooh. Yeah, it's like they're leash. running away from their stroller. 
They just leashes. There's this. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry though. I will help you by changing the subject, and you're just oh, sorry, continuing. my bad. Dick speaks from the gender super chat. Oh, look, my super chat transferred from the extra. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> What's up, Dick Spakes? Did you find your uh, Street Fighter characters? Did were you able to uh, find a Bison and Dalsum? Uh, I hope so, man. I hope so. What's up, Dick Spakes? Go follow this page for great toy photography. Uh, let's see what else we got, Yoko. Well, Bad Wolf Media asked this question. There's actually a pretty easy answer to it. Um, he's What's asking. That? He was. He's letting me know the Sabine helmet um, is up for pre-order in place. Larry, will you cut it out? But um, it's sold out on Hasbro Pulse. Uh huh. And so he's asking how um, how can a company sell out of something that they haven't made yet? And I don't I don't know when it ships, but um, the easy answer here is like so. Hasbro is both the retailer and the manufacturer at this at, for this item, right? No, Kitty, that's a bad kitty. Kitty, no. <laughs> and um, uh, God. Kitty Jail. Um, so you know they've only allotted a certain quantity for themselves. Is what I'm trying to say, right? And maybe it, it, it's, if it's already in production, also they can't just increase an order if they sell out, or you know, maybe most most of that quantity is gone to to other to other sellers. You know, so okay. like it's possible to sell out of something that doesn't exist yet because if there's only so much planned, right? So uh -huh. maybe they only had, they only, they probably only earmarked, you know, they only earmarked X number of pieces for themselves to sell on Hasbro Pulse. And if they, if they sold through that, then that's all they had. Okay. It makes sense. It makes yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I get that. That was industry talk with Yoko McCann. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Another perk to the Fallen Pet Chronicles. Yeah. You don't get where that I other just, places, guys. Where we just found out that she is part white. <laughs> she celebrated St. Patrick's Day, Dario. I heard that she's been sick. Yeah, With she got tea. all. Yeah, yeah, she got all pedal and everything. Yo, oh my god, green tea, green tea. Yeah, shot. we're we're gonna make the the <laughs> transfer, the cross production of Yoko McCann, and we're gonna do the Irish green tea, Yoko McCann. <laughs> And it will be like, it should straight look like the Arizona tea can, but we'll switch it a little bit and make, make we'll like make it, Yo, we'll make it other. Arizona make that hard iced tea now. <laughs> I saw them and Yo. I don't. What's up, son? Mijo's in the chat. What's up, Jakey? I'm about Jake, to say, Yo, Ernie, why are you talking like me? <laughs> how much to take off your hat? Why you always got to disrespect your dad like that? Did you see his video? <laughs> yeah, did you see, did you see your dad flossing on, is that what it's called? On Instagram, I that's your son that's saying that. Called. Yeah, you gotta be. You know where your comeback should be? What? <laughs> you know, it's in the jeans, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> Jacob and Joe have glorious hair. For now, yeah, they do. They do. I told him just don't ever shave it that that way. <laughs> yeah. Look at. Thank you. Thank you. So. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jake. Thanks for checking in. Um, what were we saying? Shit, I forgot. <laughs> I don't know. Are you still talking about trailers? I need another drink. Hold on. Nah. <laughs> I, know you guys, I know you guys talked about those, uh, the Star Wars Friday. deals earlier, but that helmet that has the light visor, the glow visor, I thought that shit was yeah. dope. Yeah, it was dope in the in the show. Who is oh, that? Is that? Is that Gideon's? Yeah, Moff Gideon, oh. the bad guy. Yeah. Oh, that was yeah, his. Yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah. He ended up like in a super suit yeah. at the end. Yeah, and he, and he puts that on. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> so that's nah, the first one that's that gonna. With that the the light of visor part. Hi, that was Rye. cool. Can you bring me a pina colada? <laughs> Thanks. Okay. Jacob said Look hi. Hand. Look at that Goodbye. hand on the hip. Uh huh. You saw it right. I saw it that. What do you want? Yeah, so that that one looks dope, but I think that's going to be more expensive because the 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 buckets right now go for like a hundred and thirty, right? Yeah. And then like like Yoko was saying, Target had the Rex one for like eighty, mm -hmm. and everybody jumped on that, so it was gone. I think because of this new mold and it lights up. I'm gonna guess like 165. I bet you. I, I bet Damn, you. That's a lot, yo. 
I know it is, but mold, lights, and everything, because the other ones are 130. So nah, already, you know, you know, if you do. Thanks, right. Nah, that's too much. And you know what's crazy? It was super hot. To... <laughs> what, what is she showing us? Yeah. It was super hot today. Like I had to turn on the air. And she said right now it's thundering and raining. Oh. No, that's like, that's earthquake weather. That, okay, that, thank you. That happens when it th thunders too, though, doesn't it? The humidity makes it warm. Yeah, it's so hot. I'm Isn't dying in this room. Works? Tonight's episode, Dario, is brought to you by Chi Chi's. Now we're going to go for the pina colada. These things are bomb, yo. That I just finished. Like, that looks like ranch sauce. I just finished the Mexican mudslide. So good. And now we're going to go for the pina colada. What is that? Chi Chi's. Chi Chi's for a dollar, bro. It's a mixed drink by Chi Chi's pina colada. And then all you got to do is pour it over ice. There's liquor in there? Yes, lots of liquor. He thinks. Swear to God. He thinks. <laughs> <It's>... <laughs> Shut up, you go. It's all a, a mixer. That's all it is. It's just a mix that you're supposed to be. Look, he's, he's just like his dad. Hmm. Hello, Chi Chi's. That's what oh, I thought. I lost my headphones. I thought he was Wait, he had like a these. bottle of his rain sauce or something. Ah! <clears throat> Hello, hello, hello. Did the mic go out too or no? You're lucky. I couldn't find it fast enough. I was trying to see what Lost was happening. It. Sorry. Damn it. I pulled wires in here from being fat. Oh, he My can't bad. hear us. He can't hear us right now. We can say whatever we want and he'll never know, you guys. Oh, he can't hear us? No. Hello. He cannot hear us. <laughs> <laughs> Time to take over this show. Uh, no, it's not. I'm back. Uh, <laughs> dang it. <laughs> For a second there, I thought I was done, so it was going to turn into the, the Yoko the Chronicles. Chronicles. Yeah. Dario was going to take over after that. Jesus Christ. All right. <laughs> they're mixed drinks, bro, and they're so good, but I can't find bigger than this. And then these are only a dollar. It's okay, Ernie. Size doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> Well, <laughs> the thoughts and views by Yoko McCann do not reflect those of the Fallen Effect Chronicles. We will let you know it is okay. It's not what she said, Torrenzu. <laughs> Ooh, you make my high come down. Oh. Nah, I'm going up right now. <laughs> so these are bomb. I wish I could find a bigger bottle, but it's so good. All right. See, even with the small bottle, it's still good times. It still makes everything work out. <laughs> oh my god! Look at I have a smile. Yeah, what is. if you get a bigger bottle, and then you might get trash? You get all sloppy. You know, I don't want that. <laughs> this is me and John all day. It looks big in your hands, Ernie. It does. <laughs> oh dear. Look at how large that is. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. That's me and John on a daily. And then we'll get into. Oh my god. Did you hear they want to take down TikTok because we're all giving out too much information? <laughs> That's a true thing. No, that's because don't, they don't America don't own it, so that's why I don't want they want to get rid of it. Okay. It is, but there's too much info getting out there. And then somebody go save Ryan Garcia, please. He's about to get hurt. Then you had the Nickelodeon thing go down. They're gonna oh, get tell hurt. Me, tell me about Nickelodeon. Oh, oh yeah, I, just watched, <coughs> I watched the first two episodes. I haven't seen three and four yet. Oh, there's Nickelodeon. a show. <coughs> yeah. So it's like a little <coughs> god damn. It's like it's like almost like a documentary, right? And yeah. they like all well, supposedly that uh, Dan Schneider, the creator, was like uh, being on a inappropriate, like backstage and things like that. They were talking about um, uh, what's that chick's name? The white girl, the Amanda show. 
Amanda Bynes. Oh, Amanda Bynes, yeah. Like they, 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 you have to be like, more specific. <laughs> she tried to say it. They were like that, <laughs> like um, that he was like super close to her. She'd be massaging him and things like that. And like how their yeah. relationship was like kind of weird. And then she um, said it for a long time. And then look what happened to her. They made her out to be crazy. Yeah. And then serious. And then also not only like he doing shit, but like there was um <clears throat> other employees there that were like literally um like child predators and shit like that. It like there's a whole bunch of stuff and um it's like a lot of the not like the big stars, but like the ones that like in the background, like you know, whatever. Mm-hmm. They were like the ones coming out and they're talking about it. Two like female writers were talking about it. And then um they got a uh, Drake Bell. And he's he starts confessing about uh about like his experience and shit like with that and how they yeah he did for he did a song stuff. last night yeah he released a song where was what I when all this happened sick and dying huh where's what I said where was I when all this was like when all this uh everyone yeah was, yeah, it was the whole documentary thing was a yeah. thing it was just like yeah. um. It's not nothing like huge, you know. It's not like something you're gonna see on TV at night. I don't even know what not, network it's on, bro. They're covering it up. <clears throat> and then, yeah, so like it's um, they they got like a four part thing, and mm-hmm. then oh um, I don't <clears throat> the guy um, in iCarly, right? They had that 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 Jeanette shot McCurdy. with that dude with the dreads, and it was um, Tebow, I think his name was. Right, he owned like this restaurant or something. Well, he sat down with Dan Schneider. I just saw it on Twitter last night. He sat down with Dan Schneider for like about, I think it was like an eight minute long video, literally apologizing, like, yeah, you know, I'm sorry for all the things I did, like in the past, whatever. I'm not like that no more. I'm like, I gotta watch this shit too, yo, because this is this is crazy, son. <clears throat> I grew up on Nickelodeon on, on those shows because of my daughter. So I'm like, yo, I gotta see what's going on with these people, bro. These motherfuckers are crazy. Oh Man. shit. Uh oh. Are they after you? That was yeah. <laughs> Charlie said I'll fix you. If I go out, uh, I love you guys. Continue the show, whatever you have to do. Um, that was super loud thunder right now. Oh I heard with the headphones on and everything, and this this shook right now. Holy crap. Wow. That scared me. Um, Legendary yeah. poser. It is. That's the name of. That's the one, bro. It's it's quiet on the set. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's that one. And what what is it on? Max. I have no idea. I, I got it said it's Max. Thing. Yeah. Do I want to watch this? Should I watch this? I mean, uh, well, look for Dario and other that? people. Did yeah, right. It's all that. A lot of people grew up with these with these kids Not in the really. background. Yeah. And and now a nah, lot of I people. Think was, like, Yoko used to watch like iCarly. No, I'm not, they're I'm they're not, a part I'm of it too. For that. You're a Drake and Josh type of girl, ain't you? No. <laughs> it's just um. Once again, I'm older than you think I am, Dario. <laughs> it's it sucks what all these actors and everybody go through yeah. as behind the scenes, and then they try and have a voice, and it gets shut down. Right from Epstein Island to all of this, it, it's bad <clears throat> things go on behind the scenes that is totally bad. And it's supposed to be kept quiet for so long. And if you start talking about it, things start happening to you. Right, Charlie? Mm-hmm. So it, it, it's horrible, but there's so many people now trying to get their voice out and heard. Kind of true. <laughs> <laughs> Yoko wasn't allowed to watch TV until she graduated <laughs> the university. She watched nothing but but reruns. Uh, yes, Micro Galaxy Squadron. What's up? All the P. Diddy stuff. People are talking about him. This is a lot of Illuminati shit that mm. is you're supposed to keep quiet about. You know, if you want to make it, you got to do a certain thing. That's what Ryan's talking about. And he's saying that I'm not going to take it no more. And so what do they say? Drugs. And he's going crazy. What happened to Amanda Bynes? We all labeled her as crazy. Poor Drake crazy Bell, I don't know about because they kind of said the same things about him. Somebody mentioned that, too. Yeah. And yeah, now he's he coming got- out with saying saying he got, that he got accused a while back correct um for like um almost doing the same shit correct he got right. caught talking like to underage girls or something like that and all this yes. it was it was crazy shit too that's when he was started going all crazy and they said that he was uh he went down to Mexico and he was like 
having a band in Mexico. I'm like, yo, this guy is all these all crazy stories start going out. And yeah, then that's yeah, just yeah. when people leave the letters. Like Ryan says stuff all the time too, as far as if something happens to me, I wouldn't do that. And it, it's crazy because then you know things happen. So it's just crazy if it's something you want to look at. Um, because I know we talk a lot of conspiracy stuff here and everything, but that's that's a huge one that was going on this week while Yoko was passed out. Um, was all these people coming out from Diddy to the Nickelodeon kids to other people as well um, of saying stuff out there is messed up and and it, it's not right and we're probably putting everybody out there. And then you get into the TikTok stuff. <laughs> and then you get into the TikTok stuff of why they're shutting down TikTok because it's such an open device where everybody puts everything out there from UFO footage to aliens to stories to like you don't find this stuff on Instagram. Oh, so, so now we're gonna get really cut off. Yo, you know what's crazy about that shit, right? Talk about freedom of speech, right? They're getting mad that TikTok uh, that TikTok is letting you see like everything legit. And they yeah. mad about that. So doesn't Correct. that tell you like, oh, I guess they're controlling like I guess Facebook and Instagram, right? Talking about like oh, we don't want to let you see that. So yeah, you Hashtag gone, right? You can't see that shit. So they right. mad because they they say the TikTok is showing too much. Of like what's going on, right? And and then what with the how's that crazy? Should it the news this, be doing that? Correct. With the stories of what's going on with people behind the scenes, to the closure of TikTok because we're showing too much, to everybody who's a clone is coming out, and, and um, clones as far as from um. What's her name, Yoko? That they're saying she's cloned right now. Oh, Kate. Are, are you talking about Kate Middleton? Yes. Uh huh. That <laughs> yeah. she is. Yeah. Um. Uh. What's his name that does all the movies with the Rock? Um, Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart. He died he, in his oh, car accident. Oh, he did. <laughs> there was a huge car accident that he had Kevin. that they said was fatal. That he had died there, and then all of a sudden Kevin he's Hart? here and does all this oh. stuff, right? Yes. Hmm. And that he's a clone. Um, hmm. Jamie Foxx, that's a scary one because there's proof yeah. on TikTok there's of it yeah. where they said he was dying mm -hmm. and then they brought in a clone and then they said, no, Jamie Foxx is fine. Look, at, he's right here in a restaurant in front of me and he was missing his tattoos on his head. Literally, like he has tattoos on the back of his head and there was Jamie Foxx in this restaurant, no tattoos. And they're like, yo, what's what's going on? And again, mm -hmm. videos removed. Crazy stuff. What's up, Nick's Figs? You didn't get a hold of me. Aren't I supposed to send you a figure? Good night, mijo. Be careful. Um, Nick, right? I think so. I think I have that on the side for you. So all this is coming out about them and clones and and other people. Um, the the when you say too much and then stuff happens to you. So Kevin Hart was about to say the same things as everybody else. Um. No, it was Tracy Morgan as well as, as well too. Tracy didn't, didn't die though. Morgan. Tracy yeah. Morgan is the one that got the whole thing with Walmart. He got the Walmart money because him and um, what was it like his bodyguard or something like that? One of his boys they ended up dying in a in an accident. Uh huh. He got that Walmart money. Wait, and then Walmart? Kevin Hart. Look up the Kevin Hart one. You can look it up right now of his accident. Look at his his total car, and you tell me how you survived that car crash. It was the Walmart and then, uh, truck that hit him. Oh. Uh huh. And then you have Ellen's ex girlfriend who was about to come out with the book of everything that Ellen and everybody was doing. And they said that she was dead and she pops out of the body bag on TV and they shove her did back you in. This or did you tell me about this? I told you about that one. Mm -hmm. And hey, because of the, you were telling yeah. me about what's her name. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's crazy when you dive into it. So hurry and get your TikTok account and look at all this stuff. <laughs> From ghosts, from everything. Mm -hmm. um, oh, somebody wanted to bring me up the, the little ghost kids that I saw when I used to do the schools. That was a bad what? one. That was a bad one for me. Do you know that one, Yoko? No. I think, Dario, do you remember that one? Yeah. It was one of the early stories. Yeah. I, I think Herman remembers it, too. So a lot of people haven't heard this one. If you have, I apologize. Um. <laughs> Shelf presence with a gender super chat. Ernie, the sixth day underrated movie. You're right. It is. <laughs> yeah. Oh, brick something. Okay. So um, in between jobs, I used to do as well. Um, 
uh, janitor for schools at one uh-huh. point. And I, there's a school here that it is on an old army base that they don't use anymore. Okay. Um, who put that? Did you put that up? Just look at TikTok stuff. Which no, one I... do you search? I'll take it off. There we go. Um, oh, sorry, Rensu. You're right. We're supposed to give the Rensu, <laughs> the, the Rensu warning. If you're in a basement or alone right now, we're going to do some ghost shit real quick because Brick something uh, had asked me about it. Okay. So uh, I did Janet training and everything. We live near an old army base that still functions a little bit, but you heard that a lot of people died there from sickness. There was a sickness going on. Uh, we were kind of in a middle spot where kids Locked came and door. went. Yes. And um, I got asked, I didn't have a school school. I was asked to go to different schools every night. Well, there was this one and there was a lower campus and a higher campus. And this was old school, school, higher campus to where, it looks like a very long building, but there was rooms all inside, so doors on every side, and there's there's three sides to it. So there's the first building, so it's this side, the middle has sides, and then the outside. Do you get what I'm saying? Of all classrooms that you'd walk down. And then there's an elementary swing set playground next to it as well. Well, my first night of going, because it's a military base and where you are, um, the top area was locked up. So I had a key to lock it and everything. Well, as I left like the second classroom and cleaning is in the middle of the night from, um, uh, what was it? Four to 12. And so as I left the second classroom, I heard the chains hitting the gate. And I was like, what the hell? And I went over to it and it was unlocked. I'm getting goosebumps already. It was unlocked and the chains are hanging there with the lock off. So I looked down and I can see the older gentleman cleaning in the rooms below. So we just had walkie talkies. So let's just say his name is John. I call him up and I was like, John, did I miss you? Was there something that you needed? The the gates unlocked. John then comes back on the walkie and just laughs and says, don't worry about it, buddy. Lock it and go on with your classrooms. Okay. I do another two and I heard somebody knocking on the door. I went to the door and there was nobody. I used to have um, headphones in, just little ear headphones at that time, um, plugged into my phone. Heard somebody knocking, went to the door. It wasn't. Looked out the door again, and the chains were off again with the lock hanging there. What the hell? Now I don't see him down there. I call him on the walkie. Was there something you needed, John? Because now I heard a knock at the door. He laughs again and says, don't worry about it, buddy. Go on and finish the rooms and tell me when you're done. I was like, okay. Now I enter probably the fifth room on the middle side. And as I went in, I saw somebody like a shadow run by. And of course, I'm just thinking it, it's kids like, you know, messing around and the thing. And I'm like, hey, you know, you throw the angry, hey, you're not allowed to be up here. At that time, then I hear footsteps behind me running through the hall. And I'm like, oh, oh shit, there's multiple. So I go inside, and as I went inside and I closed the door, you know the sound of a red bouncy ball? I start hearing that going through the middle of the thing. And I open the door, and there's nobody there, no anything. And now I hear kids fucking laughing, and I look at the swings and everything. The swings are going, and I'm I'm now freaked. I run out the door. I go to the front of the gate. I'm trying to call John. He answers, and I'm like, dude, what the hell is going on? I heard noises up here. He says, I'm on my way. I'm done. Hold on. And then he proceeds to meet me at the gate because I didn't go back. And all I can keep hearing is literally the sounds of kids playing in the background. He comes to the gate, and he says, how you doing? And I said, not good. What the fuck is going on here? And he proceeded to tell me, he's like, do you believe in this type of thing? And I'm like, yes. And he goes, so you've already heard the bouncing ball? And I was like, yes. And he goes, I'll help you finish up, buddy. But this is what you're going to have to deal with. And you just hurry up and do this route and lock it and you'll be okay. Are you serious? And he goes, yeah, there's a lot of kids who passed away on this base and they still reside here. And I said, so who's unlocking the gate? He goes, that one we haven't figured out, but they don't like to be locked in. So when you're here, 
they want to let you know, just keep locking it as you, as you do. And when you're done, you lock it and you walk away. I was, I was freaked, dude. I was so the initial scare of it because Yoko, I shit you not, dude, you see kids run by like shadows between the, the buildings and you hear them. I, I, I then went and bought other headphones. I, I couldn't have headphones like loud enough for me to hurry up. I, I deep breathed like every time that I had to go clean up there. It was, it was a lot. It was very, very bad. Um, the bouncing ball was the worst for me because that, that sound is so loud and so distinct. And when you look out there and there's nobody there, um, and then, yeah, I don't know why the, the gate being locked that they unlock it and it just stays swinging. And you hear this constantly as I move from room to room. So if I remember right, I think it was like 20 rooms. I swear to God, I, I couldn't get out of there fast enough. Just so, so fast of kids running by the sound of kids, the, like that, um, the movement of, of the swings and everything. And that's really a, a condensed version of what went on there. I did it for a while. I did not like it. Um, nothing against the dude who I work with, but he freaked me out too. He had the ambiance and the look of an old scary movie man. Yeah, you know, like when you're looking you, for help. You went to like who hired you for this? Like you went you went to the hiring people and you're like, I don't want to do this job anymore. John's freaking me out, man. And they're like, Who's John? Oh, I swear to God. I never ever said that, but yeah, I swear to God, you're right. That's what he felt like. <laughs> yeah. He had that look, that movie look a caretaker look so that yeah. made it a hundred times worse and you know what i literally thought about that at the time of yeah. is this dude even real yeah but yeah i would just he's like just do it as fast as you can had that job never even heard <laughs> that job. yeah yeah and it, it was, was all only in that area there's yeah. other stories you can look it up of the haunting of this base yeah. Yeah. and um it, they had a hospital there i heard the hospital is the worst um the sickness that went on of the living quarters we have full living quarters out there that you could probably move homeless in and they don't touch it they they don't not even homeless goes there it's it's that you can feel it when you can feel it that's really bad um like i said walking in tonight and i knew i felt something and i see my help my bucket moving and then the hats fall i was like okay here we go um <laughs> but yeah little kids are a trip because i feel like they don't know you, you know, they they don't. They're sitting there playing the whole time, knocking on the door, everything. I never had anything happen in the class. It was always outside, like if they were at playtime. You, you know, of, of like I said, the swings move. You can see the swings going, the 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 chains on the gate, the unlocking of the gate. Um, oh, and that one, I tested that shit because it's really it really is like a, there can't be. So I saw him down below of the walking. And so I, I locked it. I locked it and I went right into the first room and I walked right back out. Like, you know, the closing of the door and I walked right back out and there was the chains just swinging. And I'm like, no shit. Like I'd never seen anything like that. Like you think you see things move in the corner of your eye or whatever. Right. Um, that bouncy ball. Ugh, I hate that now. And then yeah. the second story to that of another freak one was I was there for about a month. It was hard, but you got to do what you got to do to get paid. Right. Um, I was back at that base in another area of a kindergarten that was active and it was next to the kitchen area. And I swear to God, when I was cleaning in there one time, I thought a tornado was happening and, and it wasn't like it was shaking the building and the, the sound of wind and I ran outside because I'm like, what the hell is going on? And it sounded like something was above me, but there was nothing there, but you can hear it. And then it was gone. And then all of a sudden, interrupt, but hell no, I'm not <laughs> going to continue listening to this. I'm going back inside. I'm scared. <laughs> but, but don't please do not stop. Continue. I'm just too pussy right now. And I got to go. <laughs> Bye, Dario. Love you. Bye, Dario. Take yeah, him out I, I don't know how to do this. Okay. <laughs> okay. Take him out. Okay, there we go. Um and then and then it was gone. And I was like, yo, are they like testing secret shit out here? Because I know a part of it is still open and ran with with Boeing or something. Mm -hmm. And that freaked me out. 
two dudes in a white truck came up and wanted to know what I was doing there. And I was like, I work here. I had to show them the, the badge that I had. Um, don't you usually do this one like at nine or whatever? And I was like, yeah, but I was done early. It was, it was crazy. And then they left and they're like, okay, I swear to God, I never knew what that was or what had happened. But I felt like I was a total in a, in a movie scene of like, they were testing shit like for reals, for reals. I was like, I was so scared, but yeah, that is my brick something. That was my bad kid story. As far as, as ghost wise, they were just shadows running. Um, I, I never physically saw like an apparition or anything, which makes it worse. I really do. I think that makes That's it worse. worse. I do. Be- because I feel like if I saw a uh, apparition, like Corinne saw the one at our old house, right? Yeah. I, I think that kind of makes it easier a- as far as, you know what they look like. There's something wrong. Right. Do you get what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know. I, it was, I didn't know. All I could hear are the sounds and shadows. And this was kids running around constantly, constantly when you were there. I don't like it either way. (laughs) I I feel like I was, um, I I really feel like you were in a time warp. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like this is going on for them and not for me. And by some chance of me walking, um, in there is, is how you get what I'm saying? Like we're not frozen in time. Yes. Yeah. 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 And, and I'm I'm disturbing it every every like time. In a time loop or something. Yeah. yeah. With with the yeah. chain, with the plane outside, yeah. the swings. Because yeah. it was nothing bad on my part. As long as I was in the classroom cleaning, yeah. There was nothing going on in the classrooms at all. It was yeah. all outside. Yeah. And so you'd move that freaking janitor push cart and I would mm-hmm. run so quick to the next one because you literally just saw down the hall shadows going through and i'm like oh shit oh god oh god and i just hurry and go to the next one have my headphones but the bouncy ball is that's it for me because that noise is so distinct yeah you know it really is so Mm -hmm. no it was worse for me because if i would have seen one i think that would put me at ease more like oh my god i'm so sorry you're stuck at recess or yeah something right like if they said Mm -hmm. teacher or start like, oh my god, this kid is stuck. No, instead, I just have sounds and and shadows playing around me the whole night. Like anything, yeah. So it was it was bad. It wasn't a scary to say like that, but it, it was it was. No, I I, it was I crazy. think seeing it is worse. I think seeing it would be even worse. Because at least when you don't see it, there's still like there's still like one level away. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know. my thing is too the ones that I saw as a kid, I will never forget that. It mentioned they were bad. Yeah. I don't like that it was bad. Yeah. Um, the shadow ones that I see, I can make out that they're okay when I reach the shadow. You know, it's nothing like a demon or anything like that. Like it's for real as a shadow person on the side of the road. Um so this, the noise for me and not being able to see something, that was that was bad on my end. So, I don't know. I get what you're saying, though. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, there you go, Brick Something. That was <sighs> that was mine. I know. And, and that's the whole thing with shadows. Brick Something said, shadows are no bueno. I was taught that when you see them, those aren't friendly. Yeah. And it's a different type of shadow. But these were kid ones. And like I said, the whole thing was they were playing. And that's where I, I, that's my best way to describe it. Like I was stuck in a, in a time warp of their playtime when, when you're up there, they're, they're literally at recess playing and they don't know what's going on. So it wasn't bad in that sense. It wasn't, um, I, I never felt threatened or a bad feeling the first time scared of that gate being unlocked. That was like their first one. And then literally it turned into the red bouncy ball and then it just turned into the sounds of kids. So it was really, really just uh and then from then I, I got louder headphones to help with it I'm like that ernie you want some fun roswell ufo happened in 1947 homies airport construction finished and officially opened in 1955 47 to 55 so total I don't know what that means total cover up total it's that's eight years if you're trying to do the math uh-huh but i don't know what that means. 
Are you saying because the weather balloon came from the airport, but the years don't match up? Is that what I'm trying to think in my head? Mm. I think Stormfire. See, this is the shit that I want to get into. <laughs> oh. Tommy K says, no way, man. Sounds are one thing, but to see yeah. something like an apparition too, I, I don't know. Well, because I've seen stuff, so I don't, I don't know. It'd yeah, make me feel if you've seen him before, you'll see him again. <laughs> yeah. They seem like like they were good, meaning they weren't poltergeists, which are usually considered hostile. Right. Yeah. I didn't I didn't have that feeling. And I've had I have bad feelings of of shadows and bad stuff. Like that's so. sad. They were just like stuck there. I know. And yeah. and so as I asked around, like I again, grandma, I started asking and everything. And mm -hmm. they said that the base was really bad, that mm -hmm. they couldn't do nothing for the sick. I, I can't remember which flu or whatever it was that came through here at the time of it. Um, but she said, yes, lots of people die. And she had said that too, as she had told me as, as long as you don't have to clean the hospital, mijo, that part. And I was like, okay, I'll stay away from there. Like, yeah, I heard that was bad. Seeing is bad. Um, it's seen you, you seen it probably worse. Yeah. The, the stare down with Corinne and, and the one in the old house, that is, that, that's, that's yeah, funny that to me. Very freaky. Yeah. Sounds like kids that play are bouncing balls. That feels all good. Like something is imprinted stuck. Yeah. Shadows feel more sentient. Um, what I mean by shadows is because they were running. So they're, I, I don't, I didn't see like an apparition, but you did see the, if you stare straight, like you know, the light, just, right? Yeah. Correct. Like somebody yeah. running by you. And I'm just mm. like the hallway. I, I hated it. I, yeah. I literally would push my cart, looking down at the cart, unlock the next room, go in, close it, and then start. <laughs> and then do the next room and and go from there. It was it was really bad. I, I had heard stories of a kid of the base. I'd never go there. Stupid kids would always want to go there. Like high school days. Why? No. This is why. It was all true. Like no, don't do that. You don't conjure up these people who went through a bad time or sick or anything. You know. No. Indian Springs Air Force Auxiliary Field originated in 1942. It took them over a decade to build an airport there. Ever ever think they might be eye floaters? What's an eye floater? Oh, no. The like float is in your eyes? You're that's what you're seeing. No. no, we're good. Like an afterlife daycare. Yeah. Like I said, they were stuck. I've seen shadows hovering around my old roommate's door. No floaters. Too big. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what that means? It means storm fire is high as hell. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> yeah. Indian Spring Air Force Base was name changed to Homey Airport, which is known as Area 51. Oh, Oh, so you know about it before. I'm telling you, let's talk about Janet. Uh, Nightmare Nemo, what's up? Oh, I thought you meant like shape of bean shadows that you can barely see through. No, 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 no. It was them running around, so the, the shadows is all you feel. Like I've said before on the other episodes, I, I hate shadows on the side of the road, and I, I, you know, I hit the brakes, and Corinne's like, What are you doing? And I'm like, Somebody just ran across the street, and she's like, What, you know. Like that. I definitely saw somebody running across the street. She didn't. Yep. I had talked about Janet Airport before too. And then that's where Stormfire has chimed in. And you know, break something, just another non existent terminal. That's how everybody gets to Area 51. You guys all laugh at me, but watch when it all comes out one day. And then we're all going to get reset and we're going to do this again in another 100 years. <laughs> But it will be God, Yoko. I, Ken. <laughs> I know, huh? I always tell you, I always have a version of where is the rich me? I know <laughs> somewhere is the rich me. There is. And he doesn't podcast or anything, but damn, he's happy as hell. Um, <laughs> for real. All right. We have Waran way over time. I'm glad we got to hit mm -hmm. everything that we did. Um, thank you everybody for the super chats tonight. That was amazing and awesome. Yeah. We greatly appreciate it. Generous um, tonight. yeah, they it was like, great. They like I, those I, hair flips. <laughs> they do. I'm gonna have to work on more. Jesus Christ. <laughs> what will we do next more. week? <laughs> yeah. Um we will be here next week. Thank you for our man on the street, Dario, for hopping in real quick. Thank you for everybody in the chat. The super chats go towards helping the the channel grow and what we're doing. So we thank you for that. Um, what else? 
Let, let's uh oh i didn't see it it ran the comments ran too quick but somebody said where's dario sticker Yoko, where's did you Dario's do stickers sticker? oh did in you? the chat okay we'll add him we'll add him in there did you do that what are they talking about the yeah i can add dario in there okay all right yes there you go we are adding that so there <laughs> <laughs> a generous super chat from Johnny <laughs> for the flips. For the flips. <laughs> thank you. We will work on more. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you guys very much. I hope you had a great evening. If you did watch Bad Batch, go over there right now. We are just running a little bit behind, but Starlight Digest has already started for a full breakdown. Join us Monday with the Boba Squadron for another breakdown in our own interpretation. We had a good show on Monday. I didn't know all of us were going to be there. Yeah. You were like, okay, I'll jump in. Paul was able to make it from his world tour. It yeah. was a, a great um, it was a great time. So go catch that replay. Hopefully, again, we can all come back for Monday and break down this last episode as we all watch it this weekend, if you have to catch up. Uh, but Sarlacc Digest is rolling through it right now. All of these are below. You can find them uh, right now below. And then um, us on Monday. And then Thursday nights with They're Not Dolls tomorrow. Chamba said I'd remind everybody. I will not be there, but all the guys will be. So please go check it out for more Toy Talk. Um, over on Toy Migo's YouTube channel, They're Not Dolls going on uh, tomorrow at 8.15. Yoko, what do you got going? Sorry. You I, I, I to know. Get a drink. I to get some been, of that chi -chis. <laughs> I started working on my Japan content, so I will have my first little mini vlog on instagram tomorrow instagram and youtube shorts probably um so keep an eye out for that starting tomorrow hopefully hopefully we'll have some fun with it save shares yes. comments always appreciated on instagram let's do that for each other and fight fight the algorithm fight the algorithm <laughs> fight the algorithm um what's up chamba yes thank you very much have a great show tomorrow chamba thank you for all you do thank you for what everybody does for this channel the the repost the the post the thumbs up like i'm learning like all that shit matters it really does, it does so yeah. a comment the thumbs up the you guys um reposting to watch the show making the thing hey we're live now um if i don't thank you enough i i really do for the team you out there hunting all the raw stuff we don't thank you enough for the, no, no, for the Ross team think. You don't thank oh. me enough, I said. I don't thank you enough, Yoko, <laughs> for making sure that uh, Grumps gets his merch page up. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Who's going to work on merch? <laughs> I don't know. We might need a, a merch page up. We'll see what happens. I've been trying. I've been trying, Grumps. I know you've been asking for the merch. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see if we can do it. Um. <laughs> And then, uh, yes, channel members, thank you very much as well. We greatly appreciate that. Just everybody, thank you so much. And Yoko, thank you for being here still sick and setting up everything for today. And the crazy hair flip, which then caused my hair flip and everybody else. We got it. We, we definitely got it going. And stay tuned to Yoko's channel for all of her vacay content. I can't wait to yeah. see it. Yeah. There's some fun yeah. stuff in there. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, if you're here still, Tommy, go ahead and hit him with the info for Paul's signing a meetup at Kevin's toy event, April something on Thor's Hill. Kevin? Thor and Loki will be Thor there. Hill. <laughs> Wolverine's going to be there. Um, Going around yeah. us. Yay. Buy what? your tickets. That's huh? for it. That's good. They're on. It's Kev's website. That's where all the information is. Toyingaround.ca. That's it? Toy yeah, toyingaround.ca. Oh, I was been waiting there? for that's more. No, that's the whole oh. website. Good grief. He has a website? Why don't we have a website? Is that where we're going to put our merch page? I, I have a website. You have a website? Yeah. I'm the only one with no website? <laughs> Jeez, how do I get a website? Like, you could say, like, the fallen fet dot. Yeah, you have uh, to pay for it, you know. Oh, uh, you have to pay for a <laughs> website? So you pay for your website? Yeah, I've had this uh, one for a while. Yeah. What do you have I on pay, your website? I pay, for, I pay for a few websites. I literally only knew about Paul's website. <laughs> that was it, because his hats and everything. 
Oh, like I need a represent mm-hmm. hat. I've had websites forever. Do you guys? Do you guys? Okay, not that we have time for another tangent, but do you guys remember the days of like GeoCities and Tripod and Angel Fire? Because I was all over those teaching myself HTML back in the day. But anyway, what is that? No. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that is. Really? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No way, dude. I was just hacking video days, games. But yeah, yeah. Damn. Yeah. Oh, what's up? Michael's in the house. Federation Forever. We just celebrated. Yeah, sorry. Go ahead. Just celebrated my 37th birthday, baby. Little Miss (laughs) Fett says hi. Hi, Miha. I hope you're feeling well. Little Fett in the house. Happy birthday, Michael. I hope it was a great day. Thanks for stopping by real quick. Um, Yes, go over then to (laughs) toyingaround.ca. Visit Yoko McCann at (laughs) irishforever.com. And then... (laughs) And get all that Yoko merch, and ours will be coming soon. I promise. So come with me real quick. Grab another drink. Let's go over to the Sarlacc Digest right now. Break down an episode, and uh, we'll see you next week and tomorrow and I'll night. Just be having a breakdown. You, you know, just regular <laughs> breakdowns. It's everybody's yeah. life right now. It's yeah. okay. Okay, big hug for everybody. Okay. Uh, Are we we're hugging? I don't. It's a big hug for everybody. We're oh. hugging the Federation. We're oh. having the yo yo yoko yo, yokoza 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 yo, yokoza. We're hugging the yokoza. We're hugging the Dario Knights, and the Doritos? there it is for everybody. Doritos. The Doritos. We're hugging the Doritos, <laughs> and um, <laughs> we're here another week. We made it through this one surprisingly, right? And surprisingly. Uh, we'll make it well, through another. We haven't week. made it yet. We had. It was week to week. We'll do every Wednesday. Larry's trying to get in the bag. This is, this is Lucy. I knew that was Lucy. I was oh. just trying to say what's up to Larry. Lucy is camera ready. Bye, Lucy. We'll see you later. I'm trying to get her okay, guys. The camera. I can't see. Okay, sorry. For reals. No, no, no. I'm, I'm just saying. Okay. Yeah. Hugs to everybody. For reals. <laughs> we love you. We'll see you next week. And we'll go yeah. through it all again next week. 100% health goal next week yes we're at 90 now and that was still that's really good 85. let's say 85 let's give okay. me some wiggle room yeah 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 that's good all right love you guys bye-bye for the heart up again i, I missed it there okay there and our, and our hugs there it is <laughs>